things. The rapid description being very angry to happy. <laughs> All right, we are live again. Damn. I'm, Do -do -do. I'm tempted to try and find like some sort of like blank kind of like old looking like notebook type thing, <laughs> like journal. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna make like a little like kind of like prop like spell book, and I'm actually gonna, gonna like, have like each of the pages be like a different spell. Who did, who disconnected? Justin. Sarah's brother. Ah. Uh, oh, I didn't even notice he was still in here. <laughs> he was just lurking. And then, like, yes. whenever I do, like, get around to my, like, summon shadow spawn mm -hmm. page, I'm mm -hmm. gonna do, like, little drawings of each of the emotions. So I can mm -hmm. have, like, a little examples of what they look like. Nice. I think... I don't remember what they all were already. Despair, fear, and fury. Fury is going to have horns. I know that for sure. And then despair. I'm thinking. That's dangerous. I, I, I feel like I got to like tap into my own emotions trying to figure out how the hell these are all going to look. But I know for a fact, Fury is gonna have horns. Like, demon horns, not pretty, like, deer horns. Yeah. Antlers. They're gonna be sharp and mean. Mm. I could totally see Fear having wings for some reason. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Anyways, I'm gonna head to bed. Okay. okay. And then I also gotta go yell at Will for being stupid. <laughs> I gotta keep an eye on that one. He's... Tell him I said good job. Okay, I, I, I will. Just tell him yourself. What? Just tell him. Just, no, I'm telling Steven to tell him himself. I, I, I could you could just him. tell him yourself. Yeah. <laughs> just ping him. <laughs> I don't think he has any- well, no, he has to be in bed. He has to Well, I pinged him anyways, he can see it tomorrow. <laughs> He's probably up anyways. Probably. Okay, yeah, but anyways, good night! Good night! Oh, you have something to say! I'm gonna say, let's jump down to table one, since we're probably- at least I'm still doing. Uh, Fine. Yeah. <laughs> Fringe. Hi. 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 So, are you live right now, Julian? Yes, I am. Okay. Hurry up. So, I have a joke for you all. Oh, oh boy. No. How many feminists does it take to change a light bulb? How many, How many what? what? Feminists. Oh, boy. Oh, God. They never get it done. <laughs> Come on, you know better than that. Feminists don't change anything. Yeah, I know. That's why I said they don't get it done. <laughs> So Logan, yeah, <laughs> you, you I... like my idea. <laughs> it's gonna take a lot of tweaking to make that playable. Yes, that, like, that's why I I'm saying like I don't know how we would do it, but that would be beautiful. <laughs> It'd be very, very beautiful. <laughs> what is going on? Uh, so I'm not gonna explain everything, but really is evil. <laughs> Well, to, to explain a little bit, I have honestly been bored playing as Rorik at this point. Mm -hmm. Although I still have some fun stuff that I want to do with him yet. Uh, there's not too much more that I want to do as Rorik. Yeah. I've come up with an idea for my next character. What it is, uh. you guys, it, assuming that we actually go through with this, you guys will have to wait to see. Yeah. <laughs> but I got, I got one more bet and I got one more joke. Oh, no. <laughs> How are Muslims like an appendix? Nobody cares until they explode. Meh. <laughs> Sir. You, you do realize I said I am on stream, right? Yeah, that's a funny joke. <laughs> people need to get a sense of humor and get the stick out of their ass. <laughs> I'm not worried about people. I'm worried about the Twitch Safety Council. <laughs> uh, Twitch mm. safety. Listen, I got something the Twitch Safety Council can take a look at. <laughs> My dick. <laughs> I'm sure. It's a, it's He'll get a some dick. Twitch Safety Council. 
But yeah, no, I <laughs> I had that idea a little earlier tonight, Logan. Mm. Uh, you know what the irony is? You're getting ready to want to retire Rorik right at in just last week. I just retire, retired Olin, my dwarf. <laughs> <laughs> I do feel like having us in this area is a good way for us to end it off, but I don't know did how you just to do? go about it. Don't worry oh, about you it. Hit, you hit yourself with a, your bow. <laughs> like, he did that fuck? when he didn't know what to do on our last playthrough as well. Just randomly, he just shoot up in the air and thunk! I just heard, like, <laughs> fire, and I turned around, and I, it took me a second, but then I saw he was glowing, because we used the fucking <laughs> spectral arrows. <laughs> so... <laughs> Turn around the man just like fucking glowing T posing on the <laughs> conveyor belt. Logan, I I've been covering my conveyor belts. Uh why? That's cringe. Because I keep flying where I don't want to. <laughs> you know you can just crouch on them, right? And they don't eat you. D but I like the idea of drilling getting eaten by conveyor belts. Even with that knowledge, I still end up doing it. <laughs> he panics. Especially with how fast I have them going. No, have you seen these conveyor belts, Steven? Yeah, I have conveyor up. belts that are very fast as well. They're cranked up to mock Jesus. Yeah, hold on. Let me... <laughs> yeah, I don't know about Julian's conveyor belts, but our conveyor belts are so fast that you can't even beat them with speed 3 while sprinting. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Logan, yeah. let me get over the factory and I'm going to show you this shit. Our one, this, this is how I'm transferring cobblestone up onto those grind wheels. This belt is fast enough, it's just fucking <laughs> eating the stone up there. Oh my god, that's amazing! <laughs> I love that so much. That's some Willy Wonka level bullshit over there. Jeez. <laughs> oh, that's what you we should do. You should have seen it when I, when I first built this, there was a bunch of cobblestone built up when I first placed a variable, and Kaiser goes, what the fuck is just a constant stream of cobblestone? Because I hadn't built this yet, so a constant stream of cobblestone just goes flying through the air and lands, like, over here. <laughs> you know, I, I might have to make a fucking chocolate factory now. <laughs> Look, I just, I love this so much. This is a yeah. Willy Wonka level, like I said, this is a Willy Wonka level bullshit over here. <laughs> yep. <laughs> This fucking yeeting shit across the air. Yeah, no, I, I I love the idea now where it's like everything gets harvested and then it just gets thrown across the factory <laughs> where it is eventually crafted into chocolate things. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it so much. Let's see. I was waiting. Uh, okay, so we got to stress. Okay, I will go, yo. Back to watching TikToks and relaxing. Ew. Okay. <laughs> I don't agree with your your form of relaxing, but good night, I guess. Well, how else am I supposed to look at e thoughts? D don't look at e thoughts. Yeah. <laughs> e thoughts are grody. I like the e thoughts. The only time I would ever look at it as an e thought is so that I could jokingly say that I'm doing more for their life than their father did. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Steven! God damn. <laughs> No, 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 he's got a point. I, I didn't say he didn't. <laughs> but god <laughs> damn. Is this frozen or what's going on here? Is this going so fast it looks like it's not moving? What's well, not moving? That. This? Right here? Yeah. No, it's it's moving. It's not moving on Discord side then. Oh, no, the belts are moving, but the cobblestone's sitting stationary. Oh yeah, because the, the, um, the place that it's going to is full. Go over here where it comes back up out. It comes into this drawer right here, and this drawer, uh, if I can see, uh, yeah, it has 32 stacks in it, so it's full. So oh. it's not outputting. I see, I see. So, because <laughs> so, this is this is all so that's to make fuck, I'm stuck on against Kaiser. God damn it. Uh, there you go. <laughs> I freed you. Did he <laughs> um, just punch you? No, he shot me with his fucking Power 5 flame bow. Look, it has Punch 2 on it. I saved you. <laughs> so, yeah, this is the kelp. Uh, and then I... Collected? Um, that little harvester set up there. Little harvester so farm. slow, Jesus Christ. <laughs> it doesn't matter how fast it's going, because the kelp I know, grows just... at a certain fucking rate. But, it's um... just amazing with how fast everything else around you is going. <laughs> yeah. Well, that, it's it's, it's because it's speed. it's completely separate. It's powered by its own set of sails. It's separate from the rest of the system. I know. I just I enjoy um, it. It's so but then, yeah, here's the thing. You can tell I built that because I couldn't be bothered to like make it go. 
Yeah. <laughs> so the kelp goes up over this conveyor belt, comes over here into uh, the into here to be mixed for the along with clay, which is being made here. The oh, black spike. Um, this cobblestone is being taken up here. It's being ground down into gravel, which then goes up and is being ground down into sand and in the process it gives some clay and a bunch of flint the sand then gets washed which turns into clay uh which then comes up here into this uh drawer um and then the the uh, combination of the two make the uh algae yeah it makes the, yeah it makes the algal blend which then goes up here uh in front of a fan and where it's then uh uh you know smelted with a lava fan into the algal bricks, uh, which the I actually I'm thinking about making the algae uh, the um, oh. kelp farm bigger so because that's the bottleneck. Um, mm -hmm. But then that goes down that gets smelted goes down here gets sent back up the conveyor belt where it then gets combined with the andesite to make the andesite alloys. Which right. speaking of andesite alloys, we have 682 stacks in this drawer. Good God. Um, and then the andesite alloys all go up. They both collect in that drawer so we can pull them out to craft shafts and shit when, you, when we need to. And then they go up and get fed into these two hoppers uh, to feed. To the fucking brim. Yep. Uh, which they and then they fill. They uh, do these two de uh, deployers. Um, and then the, these are the planks. Yeah, these make the, uh, the kinet kinetic. kinetic ones. And then uh, you can actually in the shop you can buy an unbreakable saw so you never have to refill the saw. Um, so it has an unbreakable saw there. They go over here. So there's a drawer of 2,048 kinetic mechanisms here. Um, and then the kinetic, I just have the rubber sitting here for my rubber farm. I have 80 stacks of rubber here that, so that I can craft this, just mainly craft the sealed mechanisms when I need to because you don't need them that often. Yeah. Um, then the kinetic mechanisms come out here so they can be then turned into the precision mechanisms. For the precision mechanisms, uh, starts over here with the uh, loop of s the quartz seeds that get water put on them constantly to grow them up into the uh, pure the pure nether quartz, which is here. Um, and then at that point, which fuck, it got jammed by a random thing of zombie flesh. Um, and like but at that point, the pure nether quartz that is grown comes out, and it comes over here to be mixed with redstone to make the uh, rose quartz. Um, the redstone is being made by these are generating these are things that are generating RF they're burning golden carrots to generate RF the uh, redstone is made by this system here uh, it starts over here with the sky stone whenever you grind sky stone it, uh, you, it outputs sky stone dust and also outputs sky stone um, it's uh, it's the sky stone can be in infinitely grounded so it just creates I just basically just have a loop here where the sky stone gets split off and to come back up around to be ground. Um, so you just have a, a sky stone dust farm. Yeah. So this just repeatedly grinds the sky stone over and over again. It's just one stack of sky stone that keeps getting ground to make the sky stone dust. The sky stone dust then comes over here to uh, this, uh, where it comes into this container here. Where the sky stone dust is being uh, mixed with water to make sky stone solution, um, the sky stone solution then comes up here, where it is mixed with a charged certus quartz to make redstone, um, and the the it doesn't consume the charged quartz; it just takes the charge off. It takes in a charged quartz, uses the charge to make the redstone, and then outputs a regular quartz. So the regular quartz is then going back around here to be looped back into these chargers, which charges them back into the uh, charge service quartz. So it can, it's basically another infinite loop where it doesn't actually consume them. So it's basically going to be made into redstone. And redstone gets pulled out sent to this tank, although it's being consumed as fast as it's used. These are the things that are making the RF. They're just burning golden carrots to uh, produce the RF that's running the chargers. I have a question. If you have har uh, mechanical harvesters now, or like the ones you're using for the kelp farm, why are you still using the stupid golems? Um, because we don't actually use those farms for food anymore. They're we just never... haven't torn them down. Yeah, we. I make I make these uh, plates of honey glazed ham, yeah. um, which uses honey bottles, the uh, the berries that you get from the spruce forest, like the sweet berries, yeah. and then uh, a, sh a ham shank. 
which it's not a pork chop, it's actually shank of ham, which you get from killing pigs or hoglins with the special knife. Um, and then uh, it uses those in a bottle of honey, and it makes a thing that you place down like a cake, and then you use a bowl on it, and you get four of these plates of honey-glazed ham, which gives you seven things of hunger, 13 saturation, and nourishment for five minutes. And what nourishment does is it basically makes it so you don't... Um, yeah, it just makes it you don't consume yeah. hunger for that five minutes. Um, yeah. So then... It, but, it, anyway, so, fun fact, uh, all food actually does have nourishment even in vanilla Minecraft. It just doesn't yeah. display it like yeah. it does in modded. Yeah. And that's the one thing I wish they would change in, in vanilla is show me my saturation so I know yeah. whether I'm going to survive this wither attack or not or something like that. <laughs> yeah. Um, and But then the redstone's getting pumped into this basin, which is being mixed with the quartz. Which it then outputs the rose quartz, which is then getting the molten iron poured out, which I might have to, I'm gonna have to refill that before too awfully long. Um, and to make the electron tubes, and then, which they actually just got full, so the electron tubes are starting to back up. Nice. Um, then the electron tubes do the same thing. They go up top up here to supply these two hoppers, which feed into these uh, deployers. Uh, yeah, yeah, we'll bring, bring, brings the kinetic it brings the kinetic mechanism around and then there's uh here's the unbreakable screwdriver that you can get or screwdriver that's right yeah and then uh which then creates the uh precision mechanisms so there's now 2048 precision mechanisms here ready to be used nice and that's as far as i've gotten for them in this factory oh yeah and then also i eventually i did it i did it because you quit getting on i set up the uh stone grinding to uh to washing to get the free iron um so we down here we have 419 blocks of iron can you yeah. fucking stop it <laughs> the other thing i'm, I'm sorry would you like it too ah, fuck it <laughs> only thing i'm gonna recommend steven is walls for your factory yeah wait um i have this on twilight cloak uh oh, so yeah. it just makes me invisible in darkness so mobs don't even target me in the night anyways <laughs> oh, it's not so much for mob target, it's to keep mobs from clogging up your machinery. Yeah, typically they don't. I guarantee the reason that, that zombie flesh clogged it up is Kaiser probably shot the fucker and killed him while he was on the belt. <laughs> yep. Yep. <laughs> I can't guarantee it, but that sounds about right. <laughs> that sounds like something I do. It's basically what he just said. Yeah. What the hell's going on there? Um, this is just a temporary thing for me to pour lava so I can make the infernal mechanisms. I was just um, curious why there was a, a furnace there. Uh, it was the only block I had on me to place down so I could place that tank here. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I used the furnace as a block so I could place the tank. It was the helper block. Huh? It was a helper. Yes, basically. It's a helper block. So while so, I was yeah, laying in bed, these monsters it, weren't coming at me at all, and now they're all that after invisibility? Me. I can literally walk over here and just, like... You're not... You, you have your fist. Oh. Yep. Oh, you fucker! <laughs> I thought you were gonna walk... Uh, he, he... If you put, use a flint and steel on a creeper, it sets him yeah, off. Yeah, I uh, forgot that was a thing. I thought, I thought he was gonna come over and place a fucking torch down so they could see me again. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Because it's starting to get day daylight out. That would be I almost didn't have to do that. <laughs> What's that, Kaiser? I almost didn't even have to do that because the sun's coming out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I was just sitting here, I was like, just sitting here thinking about this, this motherfucker's gonna run over and place a torch and haul ass in the opposite direction. Mm. Hey, uh, Logan. Yeah? Uh, Do you know how the ow, brass item pipes I was trying to help you shoot works? the zombie, but you killed it before I could help. Yeah, yeah, it uses the same item pump, the same pump, the mechanical pump. What's oh, that? okay, cool. Thank you. What, are you. what are you asking about? The brass item uh, pumps from Create. Oh. The only thing that I don't those the when I was learning create those weren't added yet. That's why I'm most familiar with conveyor belts. Yeah, like, no, and I, I... You could launch items. I just didn't know you could launch them that far. Me, oh yeah, no, I'm you planning on using this shit. to essentially. Uh, I'm gonna start remaking my base since I have the uh, essentially infinite materials to do so now. Yeah. Uh, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna build actual like factory buildings. <laughs> Did you see it, Logan? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the skeleton. So Kaiser, go go stand like right here, and you'll. I'll show you what I saw. So there's a there's a skeleton over here, just like walking towards me, and all of a sudden it goes. <laughs> Fucking god. 
He's gone, bitches. Mm. Oh. Before I forget to... Yeah, no, I'm about, uh, so I'm about to get into uh, the tier three of this shit, Logan. Um, which this is the tier three part. Um, so the way that I need to go is to make the right. th these fucking neon lights that you need for to make the uh, the next set of uh, the, the, fuck the neon light. That's not uh, I recognize these the things, case. radiant induction coils. Uh, what that is, uh, you need them to make the inductive mechanisms, which is the next tier mechanisms. In order to make those, you got to do some bullshit uh, where basically you make grinding. You have to automate crushing wheels being made, and then you crush the crushing wheels in crushing wheels. And the game recognizes that as like some sort of fucking anomaly and gives inception, these inception singularities as a result. So that you can then use them to uh, start chaining so through and tier. yeah, chaining through and start making all the shit to eventually make so, these. So I'm I pretty a... sure the singularities are something from uh, not refined storage. What's it called? Uh, so the uh, create got mixed with another one. The inductive. What? If you if I go look at the inductive mechanisms, uh, they're from Cube JS. Right. That's so. a, just a mob. That's just a, a filler for quest. Uh, yep. no, the singularities themselves, though, they're from that storage mod. What's it called? Uh, uh ME2. Yeah. Or, or apply, yeah, apply, AE2, sorry. Applied energy. Before they were used, you had to throw an ender pearl into an explosion, I think? Yeah. That still does or work, but you can do it different ways now. Uh, no, you had to throw a, um... It, you had, to make the singularity, you had to throw a flux crystal and something else into water, and then you could use a, a tiny TNT. Oh. That's I have a bad weird. urge. You, guys, guys, you're being chased by an, uh, an, an undermine. Yeah. Guys, I have a really bad urge. <laughs> Just fucking yoink him. Yeah. <laughs> I, want, I want to light this barley on fire, but everything will catch fire. <laughs> Not light the barley on fire. <laughs> That's you see, uh... We like field fires is how the is how third world countries get destroyed. <laughs> oh, yeah, so this elevator looking because we've like up tiered like upgeared it to oblivion. Uh, check this. Sh it's gonna take a second because it's got a neck. Look how look how fast this fucker moves. The hell? I, I like how Kaiser just like kind of floating through the the barrier, the thing as it moved. Yeah, send it back down. I thought of a better idea to get rid of it. So. Oh yeah, uh, this is Kaiser built this. Uh, yeah, that was not what he did. That. Right, yeah, I don't know if you've been on it. Yeah, and that's his. That's his um tower. tower. His his that's his occultism tower, and I keep joking he's gonna put like uh. Apparently. Scaffolding or shit around it because it's it's he's never gonna finish building it. I'll finish it eventually. When okay. I need it is when I'll finish it. <laughs> Press X to doubt. So, and then here's the resident, this resident sleep paralysis demon. Um, and then here's our tree farm that just is always full of logs, um, nice. and How's saplings. Um, so yeah. same thing. Oh yeah. Kaiser, did you pick them all super slow? You just use the windmills. It doesn't matter how fast they spin because it still gets the shit. It gets the work done, and everything grows at a set rate. So whether it spins at one rotation a minute or thirty rotations a minute, that's not going to make the trees grow any faster. <laughs> I, just, I don't. The parallel, the the, the the opposites, the such stark opposite. The things going mock Jesus and mock zero. Yeah. <laughs> You, you can easily tell what create stuff was made by me versus Steven. In, in Kaiser's defense, th this farm this was really built good. before. This farm was built before I started to create stuff. Yeah, um, no, Kaiser, I'm not taking away from what you built because understand, this is by far the most compact uh, tree farm design I've seen yeah. with create. And in then a long he has time. another one here for sugarcane, and uh, yeah. look at the look how much sugarcane we have. And that's what I mean. Like, it's, it's, I'm not I'm not mocking what you built. It is phenomenal. It's just so goddamn slow, it drives me nuts. We really need well, to tear that out, by the way, because we honestly. never use that anymore. <laughs> what, the sand? Yeah, the... that was, it was, it was uh, using sieves to uh, make fucking... Uh, uh, oh, I see, the sand. Yeah, Logan, so... the, uh, the tree farm's good to have it be that slow, honestly, because the trees take a while to plant, and, or to grow anyways. Yeah. And beyond that, you're never going to use up all the wood that you end up getting from it. 
you know, it's just... The, I like things being all the same. So if everything's going one speed, I prefer it to be either all fast or all slow. Well, I hate to break it to you, but I am not slowing the factory down because it's going to fuck with my ratios that I specifically made. If I slow the factory down, the stone won't get yeeted far enough. Therefore, I can't. I can't slow it down. Otherwise, otherwise the stone won't make it up there. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, here's, here's the thing, I, I don't want to tear the sand generator down because it just looks really neat just having all this sand come from the, like, the ocean floor up to the surface. It is very pretty, I will say, that is a very pretty build. Yeah. Like, functionality-wise, it is not the most efficient, but it is very pretty. Yeah. And it's symmetry, I like the symmetry of all that. I think that's one reason I don't oh, know. Oh, yeah, and then there's, there's turtle fuck pen. There's a turtle fuck- Jesus Christ, what the hell? <laughs> oh, fun fact, I- I was the one that went and found the turtle eggs for Kaiser because he needed them for, like, a cultism or something. NEVER FUCKING AGAIN! It took me so goddamn long- Okay, mm -hmm. look- Okay, so here is art based on the map. Yeah. There- This is Julian's base, over here, 12, 1300 meters away. <laughs> I found the fucking turtles here. This oh is where God. I had to go to get the goddamn turtles. Jesus I was lo flying around looking for turtles for 25 minutes, and then whenever I finally did them, I found exactly two turtles, and I needed to bring two eggs back so that I could so that Kaiser could breed them. Well, I bred them the so that I got the one set eggs, and then the, like the one egg, and then the one turtle fucked off. So I had to <laughs> go. I had to. Uh, get my soul gem out and go chase the fucker halfway across the ocean, soul gem him and bring him back. So th literally, uh, it was like 2 a.m. in the morning. Cause I'm like, I'm not, I'm not gonna get off until I get the turtles. I'm like, I'm just gonna get the turtles and I go to bed. I figured it'd take me five minutes. Instead, it's 2 a.m. in the goddamn morning and I'm screaming at the top of my lungs. I was so pissed off these damn turtles. I'm. It's a good thing I moved out because I'm screaming at the top of my lungs. Will you two bastards fuck for Christ's sakes? <laughs> I just, I, I just, I wish it was one of those moments where you were still living at home. Just because I just, I could, I, I just, your mom's response along would be funny. I'm just literally you know, sitting like, here, I'm literally sitting here screaming at True Trolls. Fuck! <laughs> fucking fuck! For goddamn sakes! Fuck! <laughs> I just need your child! <laughs> Here's the part that I think is funny. You had a chance when you got those turtles for them to make anywhere from one to five eggs. Yeah, and I got one egg both times. Actually, yeah. no, they always- they always lay one egg. They can just lay multiple eggs on the same block to stack up to four. I've had them lay five eggs in one sitting. And uh, I've, I've had them lay multiple eggs as well. Boom. Yeah. Um. There we go. <laughs> I cleared out a lot of barley. <laughs> so. Oh, yeah. By the way, I murdered all your birds because they were loud as fuck and annoying as hell. That's so. fair. <laughs> I didn't know what I was gonna do with the birds, honestly. I just wanted them. I don't know, I, I'm literally, I was walking by, oh yeah, this this is the house, and Kaiser drew, like, a young Donald Trump on a blackboard and put it over the board for some reason. I don't know why, but that bothers me. It's just so I, ugly. I don't know what the fuck he <laughs> did it for. Um, yeah, yeah, I never finished the house, by the way. I started building it and then didn't. Um, but, I, fuck Hold on, um, let me see if the Minecraft server is back up so I can actually show you guys my, uh, so, my house. Oh yeah, and then the, the foundry, I moved down here, into the cave. Because it was fucking massive? Ow! I was trying to help. <laughs> you hit me for six hearts, you cunt! I'm not wearing my helmet because I have to create shit on. <laughs> Look, I was trying to save you from the zombie, and then you walked into my sword. So you know how you need music discs to uh, add modifiers to tools? No, I did not know that. So you can add uh, upgrade slots to tools, uh, like yeah. the uh, tools with uh, music and music disc is one of the ways to do it. Well, you know how a skeleton get uh, you get a music disc by killing a creeper with a, uh, having a skeleton kill a creeper, right? Yeah. We made this. We just soul gem creepers, bring them down here, put them in that opening with a, a skeleton <laughs> trap back. <there. laughs> then we so, just stand here and he shoots the creeper. <laughs> guys, can I give you? A, 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 can I? Are you open to creative criticism on that one? No. Why? No, it because works. Because there's a faster way to do what you're doing, and all you have to do is is build a creeper farm. Yeah, we have a creeper well, farm. Yeah, we do have one. Yeah, because uh, for gunpowder for our rockets. Because if for all you gotta do is capture the creepers into like your collection pen with water. I hate that fucking crack. The busted yeah. stone bullshit. Fun fact: uh, I believe if you shift walk on it, it doesn't break. Yeah, uh, if you crouch walk on it, it doesn't break. Cool. Uh, so 
If, if you have if a if a skeleton shoots through fire and lets people see see that falls and kills the creepers, it still counts as a skeleton killing the creepers. Oh. And you get all those music discs in one go. <laughs> um oh, so this is the tinker farmer and you can put a bunch of upgrades yep. and shit on them, like the fucking tools. And um because of that, sh like, I put stuff on my pickaxe, like, on my, uh, checkpoint that makes me mine faster. Um, along with, like, all the shit on my hammer. And then, like, this is cobalt hammer. So, like, look how fast this fucker mines. It's almost insta-break. Yeah. Well, the fucking pickaxe is. Could you imagine if you got the hammer to insta-break with, like, a beacon effect? We actually do have haste, too. Uh, oh. the... the the, um, the hammer, it's actually coded. You cannot get the hammer to insta-break. Damn, that would've been cool. So, they they don't allow it, uh, for obvious reasons. Yeah, it would break shit. I tell you what, though, if you need, if you need a fucking, uh, ancient debris, just take this hammer and start strip mining through the nether. I'm sad the Minecraft server, the vanilla server I'm part of is not working at the moment. And the person who runs said server is not online, so I can't even get him to turn it, to fix it. <laughs> I wanted to show you my house. It's very pretty. It's built with like acacia wood and um... Oh yeah, so I wood. my old sword that I had, uh, a Kaiser had to spawn me in a new sword because it was something fucky happened with a drawer and my sword just got deleted. Um, For real? Mm. Damn. Yeah. So, um... So, but Kaiser, but in the process, I made the opportunity to change something because I put Sweeping Edge 2 on my sword. Well, Tinker... I've, we found out the hard way. Tinker Sweeping Edge works different from Minecraft Sweeping Edge. Okay, how um, so? So, Minecraft Sweeping Edge, each level of Sweeping Edge adds another half a heart on the sweeping attack. So, right. if you have Sweeping Edge 3, it does two hearts. Uh, Tinker Sweeping Edge takes a percentage of your attack damage and puts it onto the sweeping attack. Oh. Uh, sweeping Edge 2 takes 67% of 15.64 and puts it on the sweeping hit. So, aka 10 to 11 damage. Um, yeah. Damn. Learn the hard way, I killed a zombie over here and accidentally murdered two villagers in the process. <laughs> <laughs> that is the gun. So, I kill, and then before that, when we were fighting a raid, I killed a, pill a villager right here and accidentally murdered, like, every chicken in Kaiser's chicken farm. Ah, oh. oh, but of course. <laughs> there was I like, like how, with all the what? mods, you still have an, uh, a vanilla chicken farm, Kaiser. Uh, with the exception of just the, oh, the, the... the timer. I like that. Yeah. That's yeah. one thing I do like about, like, modded Minecraft like this. Like, lightly been, like lightly modded packs can have something like this. And yeah. for someone who doesn't do redstone, it's a life changer for them. Fun and fact. Someone... Uh, fun fact. If you want to annoy Kaiser, you can set this timer to go off five times a second, and it, the sound <laughs> annoys the fuck out of him. <laughs> oh, really? Show me, please. I would like you to hear the sound for scientific purposes. <laughs> I, you uh... fucker! I didn't even do it! <laughs> oh, I did it right as I'm about to die, though, because you were hitting me. I actually so. also just have a vanilla set up for my uh, egg farm. Uh, I have 35 I have the, levels, uh, by the way. So. I just have a yeah. bunch of pigeons yeah. in a forever oh, well. box. And, <laughs> it's not like the fucking levels even matter because of the <laughs> fucking uh, heroes medallion that I made. The Heroes Medallion stores your levels, and Kaiser always yeah. has it on, and every now and then he just throws it to me so I can stick my levels in it, too. How many levels is that thing up to now? 251. 251 levels? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'll, it's to I'll, the point where, like, if you need to do a level 30 enchant, it doesn't even, like, it doesn't even take, like, two levels out of the thing to get you to level 30. See, and that's why what's great about that thing is, like, it, when you combo that with something like, um, Apotheosis, which raises a level cap for enchanting. Yeah. So good. All right, so Steven, I learned of uh, some really fun information. Oh. So you could silk touch broken stone. Okay. And if you put a carpet on top of it, and you try to step on it, it still breaks. Oh, interesting. So I'm gonna place a Viet Cong <laughs> fucking punji <pungy> stick trap. <laughs> <laughs> um, surprise! That was what he went to. Oh, uh, uh, so also the you know how the buddy cards is mod is in this pack? The uh, yeah no what huh? Uh, so buddy cards. Um, oh, buddy cards. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry. Yeah. So um, the base set, uh, whenever you complete it, it gives you this uh medallion that oh. if you put buddy boost two on it, it just permanently gives you speed three. Oh. 
Um, there's some other ones as well. I have them all in my backpack. Uh, the end one when you uh, with Buddy Boost two, it you have a constant resistance two when you have it equipped. Nice. Um, the I'm Nether you set. Have multiples, can I, uh, no, you can only have one equipped at a time. The Nether set, um, by default, just regularly it gives you fire resistance. Um, but if you have if you have Buddy Boost two on it, it gives you strength and something else. While you're in, like while you're set on fire. Yeah. But um, Steven, but if you want to clear that stuff on the left side of your screen, just hover over it and hit A. A. Yeah. Oh fuck! I didn't. Have, I was wondering how that shit goes. If there. you, it's it's great. It's a JDI thing. If you like, you're trying to set up like a, a multiple thing you want to craft. You can just hit A across the things. And it'll put them in that hold list, so you don't have to keep looking. For yeah. Them. Um, but if uh, just something goes weird in mod packs, and yeah. it just starts auto uh, putting stuff there. I found out the create one with Buddy Boost Two gives you haste three. Oh. Um, and then the aquaculture one with buddy boost gives you what is it luck two Kaiser luck two and dolphins grace yeah so and then there's one there we're st we still need to finish getting up getting the farming set and then I actually discovered there's a hidden set in here it's called the byg set uh, and the only way you can get it is by crafting the random or the mystery card packs but they are expensive as fuck damn a buddy <laughs> card pack of any kind. Two yeah. diamonds, uh, two blocks of emeralds, two blocks two of iron, and two phantom membranes, and it and one one pack gives you nine cards. But the they give you nine cards across all, all sets. The sets. Yeah. So it is so fucking difficult. We still we we're still missing one set from the farming from the farmers. Uh, one card from the farmers set, which that one gives you. I think it gives you nourishment or some shit like that. <laughs> uh, so your you know your food goes down slower. I so. like how these guys, the, the smelly straw golems, are still just collecting stuff. Yeah, they're they're still chugging away. Yeah, the, the farm the, is not as good as it used to be. <laughs> the one thing that I still that they have been at least somewhat useful because the one thing that they're still good for is the um the is harvesting the carrots because Kaiser made a uh he did the whole you know use ender pearls to get through into the roof uh, like over the nether. Yeah. Um, so he has so that, a vanilla gold okay, farm. Yeah, though. he has a, built a big gold farm um, for powering the RF for these uh, yeah, chargers. Yeah, you showed me you had the golden carrots going. Yeah, you have golden carrots going in because in these Gorman diamond dynamos, a they golden carrot, a a, they produce thir a little over 32,000 RF per one golden carrot. Mm. What are you doing, Kaiser? What the fuck are you doing, Kaiser? I'm evening them out. <laughs> no, I had no, 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 no. I had them. This this one I had higher for a reason because this one uh, has an upgrade in it that makes it produce more, more. Uh, uh, it doubles its output. Yeah, it doubles its RF output, but it uses fuel faster. That's why I had that one higher. That's why they weren't even. So, I did that. I did that on purpose. So. But All right. So and because th with this one being boosted and this one not being boosted. It's enough that they produce slightly faster than these consume the charge. Mm. So, it takes that much to fucking use the charger. This thing it was like free in fucking older versions. There, yeah. there's two, uh, I I have two chargers running as well. So, there's well, two it's chargers. not been free in a long term in a long term Kaiser, but I think with this pack the config is probably set higher because yeah. it doesn't actually cost a lot of RF to do the to do the, the charging. I mean, yeah, this yeah. is generating 120 RF a tick. So, yeah. yeah. It, it doesn't use that much standard, so... Yeah. But remember, this pack is meant to be difficult, so... By the way, did this, did this pack change how the, the flux cells work? Because didn't they use... There used to be different tiers of, of cells? So, the answer is yes, but no, not because of the pack that they changed. They just changed... The, the mod the itself mod, changed. The mod As author himself at 112, that caused a lot of mod packs of mods to be re Like, the, the mod authors redid them, some yeah. more than others. So what he did is he made the energy cells the same as the machines, where they start at a base tier, and you can put the upgrade kits on it. Yeah. Well, no, in this one, what you do is you actually put the holding book on them. Uh, you uh, enchant them with holding. A, that is a pack thing. Yeah. Um, so it's actually kind of nice because, like, the for example, that art, that cell bank, by default, holds one million. Uh, but you can get up to holding four. Each level of holding adds 500,000 RF capacity to it. So it has holding four on it, so it holds three million. Yeah. Um, the tanks by default hold 32 buckets, but each level of holding adds 16 buckets, so if you put holding 4, it holds 96 buckets. Yeah. So. Uh, is the iron drum mod not in here, in this pack? I never looked, but... Uh, what the fuck is it called? No. Iron, it's this is iron drum. Yeah, it's so. not. 
You don't, don't do at. Just look up iron drum. Or just drum. There's nothing called drum. Nope. Yeah. The iron drum was the best. 256 buckets, and it cost iron. Not a lot yeah. of iron either. Like, two, yeah. four... Ten, yeah, I know exactly the mod you're talking about. I know exactly the mod tier. you're talking about. Top tier. Um, I'm yeah, sad that you can't ride the ostrich from this pack, because that's the only reason I kept the birds. Um, yeah, down here is our alloy for making our... Because you have to make manual in for the armor and shit. Yeah. Um... Oh, shit. I actually need to... Uh, forgot. I actually need to put this back in the slot. Which slot do you go in again? I cannot remember. Pants, that's right. That way I can... It's not taking up inventory space. But I can still access the storage. Which, Kaiser, we're probably gonna have to make the upgrades for him soon. Yeah, like 400 we're... slots left, basically. Yeah, we're at 1,200 of 16... 16... Yeah, it's 16. fine. You'll, you'll, you'll wait until we're at, like, 10 left and be like, fuck. <laughs> yep. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> the, the whole reason we had The tier 3 and 4 are easy to make. The only reason we haven't done it is, uh, they're called what, stabilizers? Yeah. yeah. The only reason we haven't done it is because the tier four require, or the tier two requires a block of silver, and oh, the only way fuck. to get silver in this mod is the fucking coins. Yeah. So, because, like, three is just gold, a nether star, like, and then the, the fucking tier four is, uh, oh. That's a, uh, uh, um... Occultism thing, and then yeah, hard to get, though. yeah, Kaiser has the goggles that lets him just fucking see it easy, easily in the yeah. nether. So, well, you have to wear the goggles to be able to harvest it. Yeah. yeah. So, but yeah, and, uh, but yeah, so like the anesium, ne it's just that fucking silver. Cause like, to upgrade it, we we have what six of them, Kaiser. Six of the yeah. stabilizers. Six, yep. So we did six blocks, which would be fucking fifty-four uh, ingots. ingots, which fifty-four times nine is. Can't you sell stuff in the trade thing for four silver? Yeah, but the issue is just getting that much fucking silver. It's so how dumb. much silver do you need? Uh, what's like fifty-four much... times nine? Oh, so each coin counts as like a, a nugget. Each coin is a nugget. Oh. Said 54 times 9? Yeah. Uh, 486 nuggets. Yeah, coin. Yeah, we only have 149 coins. Like, we could get them. It's just so, what be... can you sell that's easy to make to get coins? Nether uh, stars. Yeah, nether stars. Uh, one nether star uh, gives uh, one gold coin. Which, Which breaks down to how many silver? 64. Not bad. There's a couple other things that you can sell that are decent. Um, I think the wood, the the ribs. Wood is, is probably the best one to automate it for. The wither, the withered ribs are also really fucking good, um, because they drop from wither skeletons. They sell for fifteen silver coins each. You only need thirty-two ribs to make up what you need. Yeah, to be and we are—we have a fuck ton of those from just from killing them with our looting swords. Yeah, we have ninety withered ribs. We could quite, and there's probably more in the system. We could literally get the silver we need to upgrade the system. Oh yeah, right the, there's there's definitely more at the um third farm. You just yeah. need the hunting thing and the trade thing. I already have yeah. that over here. Uh, yeah, Kaiser already has it. Oh. So you yeah, might as well just throw the throw forty-five oh, or a stack that works too. <laughs> Never mind. Yeah, like. How did you drop a coal? What the fuck? <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> uh, only problem is, yeah, it gets full, and then you gotta take it out. Can't yeah. Is that a hopper underneath it? I could, but the problem is, this is a one block floor. This is a one thick uh, floor. Yeah, because right. down here's down here's the sex dungeon. Oh my Christ! <laughs> Just set a hopper pointing into a drawer right at at foot at floor level. No. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> then babysit the machine then. Fuck it. So yeah, no, I, I, so I, I don't know if you've ever, you ever got on after I built this foundry, Logan. Mm. Uh, 
This thing is fucking stupid. Um, the so I this thing is smaller than our smeltery, like the original like right, first year smeltery. Because uh, you remember this that first year smeltery, you can smelt two blocks at a time, right? I and have I, a question. What? Or what? It's like it smelt two stacks uh, at a time. Sorry. No, no, no. Why are the walls in on the same level as the floor? When shouldn't they be out of level and get you more space? No, the, this does not work like that. You, the base has to be the the walls have to be the same size as the base in the tier two one. That only works oh. for the tier one one. Um, Weird. So, but how many silver thing... coins did I need for the thing? Uh, look, look. It was nine times uh, fifty four. Nine times that requires me to do Four hundred eighty six. Four hundred eighty six. Would you like me to break that down the stack for you? No, I'll do that. <laughs> um, that's like seven and a half stacks. Yep. Yeah. Um, so this thing does a lot of important things. First off, it smelts faster. Right. Uh, I remember it does that. It gives you a higher yield per smelt as well. Yeah. So each dust in the old one would give you three nuggets. Three. This one this doubles it to six. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I remember we just got it set up uh, the last time I really got on and did anything. Yeah. So another thing about this thing that I discovered is it's the the overall capacity that it has to store molten liquids is fucking stupid. This thing right now it's uh it has the because the old smeltery had a capacity of like 800 ingots uh in it um and it what it had it was able to smelt two full stacks of stuff at a time. Its inside space was 128 blocks oh. inside. This one is uh, only a stack and a half. It's 64 plus 32. So it's only 96. This thing's internal capacity in total is 2,016 ingots. Damn. So, yeah, and uh, additionally, another thing that we discovered, um, whenever you smelt dust, anything inside this foundry, it also, it has a, it gives you the main product. It also gives you a little bit of a byproduct. It for gives example, you a byproduct like when you're grinding it? Uh, like, for example, if, let's, let me look up cobalt. Um, if you smelt a cobalt in the foundry it gives you uh one cobalt or gives you one ingot and six nuggets of cobalt but it also gives you three nuggets worth of iron Ooh. um if i go to let's look up we'll say gold uh look up the gold dust here you put, put use it in the foundry it gives you uh the nuggets worth of gold but it also gives you a little bit of zinc as well nice. <clears throat> So, it's really nice because you get a lot of free resources, but it also sucks because wherever you do mass smelting, you end up with so much shit to pour out. <laughs> yeah, the foundry looks like a fucking, like a, a goddamn rainbow had an orgy in there. The yeah, this, some of this is just random stuff. There's only a couple nuggets, so I just leave it in there because it doesn't need poured out. Like, that one's just three nuggets. That's copper that can be poured out. That cobalt's only six nuggets, so I haven't poured it out. Uh, that's only six <laughs> nuggets worth of diamond. Uh... Some random venom that I need to get rid of. Some Probably molten debris. Then molten gold. Um, so, yeah, like, it's just, um... But, yeah, we just... But, like, whatever you smell... I, I came back from a mining adventure the other day, and I dumped... Like, I just mass smelted a bunch of shit. And I shit you not, I was standing here for ten minutes just pouring stuff out. <laughs> Why you made that? Red's gonna say something. Uh, no, I, uh, we do, that's what this thing is for, I place, I just place a slab here with a timer on it, so that the, the time it takes for these things to pour is four seconds, you set a timer to four seconds, and it perfectly loops these things to do it. The only issue is, well, uh, you have to, like, keep an eye on it, because once it moves to the next thing, if there's not enough to make a perfect block, then it partially fills these, and it never moves on, because these are sitting partially filled. See, that's the but, only reason I do, even though it's slower, I do it with the ingots. Yeah, so what I usually do is I don't set up the timer. I have four blocks worth of things here, and I will pour as much out as I can as blocks and then do ingots to finish it off. Uh, so. Well, all right. I gotta go back. I'm tired. Okay. Peace. Have a good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs> I'm going poop and going to bed. I didn't want to get one to take the world for. Is he right. still in the chat? I don't nope. know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sarah noticed. <laughs> oh, that was good. <laughs> oh, fucking zombie. Fuck off. I'm trying to sleep here. Man's gonna go take a poo at.
Take a bow up. And now we up. can try and sleep. <laughs> yeah, the, the tour was very important. Yes. <laughs> oh, by the way, Kaiser, I killed some phantom membranes while I was on earlier, so we're up to 25 again. Nice. So, if you want to start making mystery packs again. We're probably going to have to actually craft sticks, though, because I don't think our stick farm is fully recovered from the... Oh, it has not. From the fucking apocalypse. Yeah, so it's <laughs> back up to 3,300. We had been full on sticks, Julian, and then we started selling sticks to villagers, to Fletcher villagers for emeralds, and oh, uh, we fucking ran out of sticks. <laughs> <laughs> we have sticks. We no longer have sticks. <laughs> <laughs> I am once again... Again, asking for your stick support. <laughs> Honestly, should get myself just one uh, Fletcher villager, just so that I have on hand someone to sell my sticks to. Yeah, fair. Yeah. Time to empty the the fucking honey again. Okay, I need that. I know I'm gonna need at least another of these. Probably more. Uh, I'm get, I'm switching oh, my uh, system up. I'm uh, switching to a system that uses item pipes to bring the items up from the ground. Yeah. And it's going to be fucking expensive because it's brass. 80 bottles of honey. I'm so sad they nerfed honey as a food source. Um, <laughs> They did it in vanilla Minecraft. Back whenever honey first came out, it was such a good food source. You could drink a bottle of honey and it would give you... It was like four bars of hunger... And, like, eight saturation, and they nerfed the ever-loving shit out of it because people were making honey farms for food. Fuck. Nicely done. I was doing the fucking water bucket thing, and I somehow hit an edge oh. that shouldn't have even been there. Rip. Okay, Steven, I've got a question for you. What's up? Alright, which one of these... Oh, never mind, actually. <laughs> it's obvious which one is the better one. <laughs> which one looks more like grass? Yeah. <laughs> you, you place that down, then immediately realize how fucking stupid of a question that was. <laughs> like, never mind, pretend I didn't ask that. By the way, did you melt down all the silver needed? Yeah. Blocks? Okay. I'll you do it work. eventually. <laughs> you got the six blocks in. Eight, yeah, there's yeah, the nine. Ten, okay. 11, 12, yeah, because you could just break the ones that we have 15. here, upgrade them, and place them back. Yep. Because it, it keeps it's it memorizes the inventory. You just can't place more shit in while it's going yep. while it's like doing that. Yeah, I, I'm currently uh pretending to be the Vietnam or the, not the Vietnam the Viet Cong. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the only thing is, the tier 3 one's fucking easy, it's just four nether stars. We have a bunch of nether stars, I think, unless you sold them already. No, um, we have them still. Yeah, so just keep five around, four, or no, seven around, because six for upgrading the things, and then uh, the seventh, because I need the beacon. Well, very convenient, we have seven. <laughs> that works. There we go, we've got the seven, then we can do that. I have a problem. Because uh, I need one for the beacon. What's up? I ran out of pipes. Oh. <laughs> and I'm kind of in the ground. Oh shit. Uh what pipes do you need? Brass pipes. Brass. <laughs> I can maybe bring you some. Just the yes. brass item pipes? Yeah, yeah. Alright. Uh All right. Yeah, I can bring you some. <laughs> Thank you. Alright. How many war crimes am I committing with? How many making... do you think you're gonna need? Mm. Looking at this whole, I'm going to say at most, how, how much is one per, I, I would say it's two eight of those. Per yeah, so 16. All yeah, right. that, that should be more than enough. All right, you have six brass. All right. <laughs> I'm on the way over. All right, so I want to know, uh, like, how many war crimes I'm committing with uh, making a hidden spike trap uh, that... Hits you with a harmful potion effect. <laughs> I mean, it's only a war crime if somebody reports you. Let's no, no, no. Her. It's only a war crime if you lose. Yeah. <laughs> essentially. Alright, so I need to make sure that whoever gets hit with this trap dies. Excellent. Yes. No witnesses. <laughs> uh, well, I know the exact person to hit with this trap. 
Cassie? <laughs> uh, no. May. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> or Air. Eh, Air is not on, like, at all anymore. <laughs> She's been sick. So, oh, fuck, I flew past your hole. Wrong one. Nine. Uh, oh, it's over here. <laughs> nope. I, I'm on, on my fucking way there. I just gotta weave my way around your <laughs> bullshit. <laughs> There. Thank you. Did, I get did it? it fall down past the pipes? I think it did. Probably. Fuck. How do I get down there? Is it? How do I get uh, to the on bottom? the other side of the conveyor behind you? The long one. The long one. The, you you went away from it. Go back to the hole. That long conveyor. Okay. Okay. <laughs> right there here. you go. That's part of why I'm rebuilding everything. Is because I want to have an easier way about. It might yeah. have stopped somewhere along the backside too. Up, uh, uh, picked got up him? a fucking. But no, I got a bunch of fucking oh, stone. Uh, where's your head at? And then I'll I'll just go to your fucking head. Uh, so if you look at, yeah, fo following that backwards, you see that there going up. Yeah. <laughs> the fuck are they? I was saying it could be along it. God damn it. Yeah, I see them floating down there too. Shit. Hold on. I might be able to get them this way. I, I can't break blocks to even like, get to anything. Got it. You got them? Yeah. They, oh, they got stuck on one of the pumps. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. Five. Place a pump. Right, now I need to get back up to the surface. <laughs> Huzzah! I made it to the surface. Thank you. Yep. <laughs> That's next step is going to be doing this again, but with shafts. <laughs> shafts. Oh, there's oh, a shaft God. in the. There's a <laughs> fucking shaft in the way. <laughs> I tried to fly out and I bonked my head off the damn shit. Yeah, shaft. that was added recently. Sorry. <laughs> That's I, I'm literally getting ready to work on reworking the entire system. Also, fun fact <laughs> uh, added into this thing: if you try and catch yourself on a ladder, the ladders will instantly stop your momentum in this uh, in this pack. <laughs> so, <laughs> Donka. Or, or where is your, where do you want me to put the fucking uh all this cobblestone that I picked up? Uh well right beside me, oh cobble. Uh there's a cobble. No, it's like all there. the various it's all oh, the various are our way here. Right in front of me. I don't know if I can I don't know if I can put in to I mean okay, you can I take can. them if you want. I, I can put <laughs> in, I just can't take out oh, because weird. of it. Saws yeah. are coming behind you. <laughs> ah! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, man. <laughs> is there a reason it's not planting two trees right here? I don't know. Or is it? It's pro oh, it's probably out of saplings. Probably needs more saplings because it's not planting in a couple different spots. Yeah, spruce is weird. It doesn't always give like the proper amount of saplings. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna sit here and AFK on your uh, spinny boy. <laughs> okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, now then, let's see. <laughs> Yeah. Well, he's being AFK. Uh, I'm just no, but it did, it did put weapons. all the cobblestone in. The cobblestone's <laughs> back in my inventory. Fuck. All right. Well, then I know what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna chuck it on the conveyor belt and let it sort. Uh... Yeah, back here is the best spot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there we go. At least it's an efficient system. Because it's brass, so the brass can pick up a full yeah. uh, thing at a time. Okay, uh, I'm going to need to eat some rice to heal. Because digging down oh, is going to be a pain Jesus again. Christ, I'm already getting PTSD from Kaiser. I saw the pu a piece of pipe stick on the ground. I thought he pun pungy snuck up a pungy stick dust. <laughs> what? <laughs> Fucking stick trap. I thought he's. I saw the, 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 like, the jagged edge of the pipe stick on the ground. I thought Kaiser <laughs> snuck up a place to punch you stick when we weren't looking. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I feel like Kaiser's gonna try and get me with it the most because I fucking live with him. 
<laughs> Jeez. Look, you, you have any idea how annoying it is to make these things? <laughs> I have to go through a fucking six-stage brewing process to make these things. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> So you're not going to make a lot, is what you're saying? <laughs> uh, probably not, no. <laughs> Alright, I feel slightly safer. Not yeah. completely safe, because you still are making some. But... <laughs> oh yeah, I know, it's like while you're gone, I'm over here just perfecting chemical warfare. <laughs> hmm. I thought of a way to finally get rid of this chest that's just floating here filled with stuff. Oh. I'm going to go... in a chute. Oh, you just got a fucking shulker, or shulker box. <laughs> shulker box full of bungee sticks. <laughs> yep. Alright, I'm gonna sit AFK here on the corner. I gotta go pee and get a drink, and then I'll be back. So. Okay. Do that. And then I need a hopper. Do, 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 do. Oh, wait, fuck, that's not the right height. Fuck me. <laughs> well, I thought I was gonna use my brilliant plan. Apparently not. Nah, your brilliant plan was Garbo. Yes, yes, it was. Let's see, break that. Come over here. I guess I can pick this guy back up. The shoot plan will work, it's just I gotta do it a different way. Steven really should have AFK'd at your base, because <laughs> I immediately just split him <laughs> the second he left. Jeez. No mercy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, next phase of punji sticks. It's not gonna work either. It's too. Oh, no, I'm just stupid and placed everything too low. Duh. I do that kind of shit to myself sometimes. Do it like that. Go ahead and break this bitch. Go like that. And now I just need my shoot. There we go. Boxes are emptying. It's going to be a pain to set up this uh, power system for this thing. Because i got to take shafts all the way from bedrock up. Yeah, that sounds awful. At least it'll be more uh, efficient. <laughs> Plus, when we actually go down into that pit, it'll uh, be a little easier to move around. Not that we ever go down there. But it's just a bunch of, like... Uh, Conveyor belts and stuff that I can just pick up and not have to have down there anymore. Crashing up some more sage. I want to see, there's, uh, there's some methods that you can use with, uh, tobacco that will help to stop it from being stale like to re-moisten it moist I want to try it on this sage because my sage is essentially smudge sticks which they're made dry so if I can moisten some I can see if that uh, 
enhances like the flavor or the harshness or anything. God damn it, I knew I'd be in the sex dungeon when I got back. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Kaiser, come down here. Oh, I can already see it on your screen. Just, just, just come down here. What the fuck? Yeah, no, no, I, I see it on your screen, I can see. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck is going on here? <laughs> Sex dungeon. It's just what happens out there. <laughs> Do you see this, Julian? <laughs> yeah, it's an orgy. Don't worry about it. Look, like, this guy's not even in the fucking bed! <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> There's just a random dude with a monocle. <laughs> He's the mayor. <laughs> what the fuck? That's so dumb. How's your brewing coming along? Uh, pretty nicely. If you look at the shulker box, you'll see the, my efforts. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> making so many fucking... <laughs> Chemical warfare, baby. <laughs> Boy. Uh, hey, we're yeah, still no, good on food. Pet, 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 pet Barry here has been keeping me company while I've been brewing potions. He's a good pet. Uh, I'm just watching these zombies try and get me as I'm up top. Uh, I hear some zombies, I don't like it. Well, there's one right outside the door, but they can't get to us because of the interdiction torch. Haha, <laughs> uh -huh, stinky. Let's see, where am I at? Alright. This is the last of the potions I'm gonna make. Good old interdiction torches. Yeah, for the trap that I've designed, it uses uh, 21 punchy sticks. Jesus Christ. Yep, they and they're a pain in the ass to make. <laughs> if they live, it'll be a fucking miracle. Oh, yeah, no, I, I, I've i learned a lot about making deadly traps. <laughs> so if they survive, uh, which I highly doubt they will, uh, uh, that'll be an absolute miracle. Uh, okay, so actually I gotta test something real quick. Do the punji sticks get destroyed by water? Oh, uh, Julian, I can sleep. Oh, they don't. Fuck yes. Give me a moment. I got a little baby over here I gotta kill. I see that. Got some good XP from that, though. Uh -huh. Damn it! <laughs> Alright, so what am I going to need? I'm gonna need bone meal. Yeah, I have, um, I have a th experience on my pants, so my pants give me more experience. And, um, <laughs> like, just wearing my pants, I automatically just, everything drops more experience. I also have Dragon's Greed from the one thing Kaiser made, so this stuff drops, like, 50% more experience. So I get, like, double the experience from everything. It's fucking stupid. Jeez. <laughs> I get so much experience. Off I go! You need to go crap me. Yep. Speaking of May, I'm surprised she hasn't been on today. <laughs> well, I mean, we did have D&D. &D. Oh, fair. Oh, I know exactly where I'm going to put the trap. So hmm. I can't build in her claim territory. But she has this nice little forest next to her claim territory. <laughs> that is the perfect place for a trap. <laughs> Time for elevator music. Elevator music. Why is her house still damaged? She hasn't rebuilt it yet. Oh, there's the boat, Enderman. Her entered, boyfriend. <laughs> entered my boyfriend who is not kidnapped. Understandable. <laughs> Alright. Understandable. Have a nice day. Ooh, this is like the perfect place to build it. Or is it? Yeah, let's build it here. Guess we'll find out. I mean, mm -hmm. really, I don't expect her to like be very smart. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> yeah. Okay, 
let's see. I think I should have... Well, fuck. First, let's get rid of this that's in my inventory. Clear up stuff a little bit. I wonder, can, I wonder if the... Uh, can I wonder if the Gorman Dynamo can burn rotten flesh. Probably. I think it just burns any food item. <laughs> it can do. It can do. What the fuck? Sweet berries give thirty two hundred. I figured it'd be a lot lower for those. <laughs> Probably any that many. Oh well. All right. Let's see. Did I leave In my fact, toolbox down there? Mm. Fuck. Yeah, I'll, I'll stream my uh, me building the trap so you could just see all the devious trap making knowledge that I know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that should be plenty. Now I gotta dig back down alongside this. We're gonna say on this side, I think. I need apple. Pepper. Oh, hey, you can put all the fucking fish in here, too. Might be a way to get all the damn fish out of the fucking system. Probably. <laughs> I actually don't see rotten flesh in here. I don't think I can eat burn rotten flesh. Huh. Interesting. Oh, this might be another good thing to use for for a fucking pork. All the goddamn pork chops we have. Mm. Cook all the put all the fucking pork chops in. Mm. We've got 1,200 fucking 1,260 pork chops. <sighs> Holy shit! The electron tubes are full now, too. Hell yeah, got to the surface. I'm thinking, well, let's put this down, gather stuff back in. I would think since this is all turning the same way, it should be working right, and I should not have to go down and uh, fix anything. Um, obviously, I'm going to go test it, but, you know. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that's going the right way, so... Oh, fuck. Not what I wanted to do. Let's go to the top and see if this is functioning right. 
It should be spitting out andesite at the top. Yeah, when I get up here, there should just be a mess of andesite. <laughs> if it's gotten to the surface yet. Yeah. So it might take some time to get up. Do do do. Please. Hmm. I wonder if you're using the brass item pipes from Pretty Pipes, right? Mm -hmm. I wonder if those pumps don't work because there's actually a pipe pressurizer from Pretty Pipes as well. I see that, but it says about like making it faster, essentially. And I was looking, like I actually made one. It does not have a way to designate direction. Yeah. I don't know. So my thought is, this is just meant to speed it up, but to actually have it function, you have to have the, like, normal ones. Yeah. Fucking... Yeah, I was right. I filled that fucking fluid container, and that was enough to make uh, enough electron tubes to make a full a full third like thirty two stacks of precision mechanism. Plus, Kaiser pulled like five stacks out and put them in the system, and another whole fucking drawer of electron tubes. And there's still over six buckets in there because it uses so little iron to make those tubes. Yeah. And it was taking out at the bottom, I should mention that. Mm. So it's definitely doing something. By the way, RE and FE are a 1 to 1 ratio. Mm. Or RF and FE, sorry. One stands for redstone flux, the other one stands for, I think, flux energy or some shit. Some shit along those lines. Please start pumping out. By the way, Kaiser, if the if you're ever on and the barrel of food is getting low, um, I've actually made um, another 69 hams that are in the system ready to just be, like, placed down and have bowls used on them. So, All right. To make more. There's just another, there's literally just 69 fucking honey glazed hams in there. I feel like you've done that on purpose. What, 69? Yes. Uh, no, it was actually just the um, no, exact number of hams that were left in the system. I thought it was really funny as well when I saw it. I was like, of all the fucking numbers it could have been, it's the one it is. Well, see, I don't know if you guys have been seeing what I've been building here, but it's like, oof. I have not been paying attention. Is brutal. Hmm. Hmm, climb back up to see if any of this is going through. So we're up to uh, twenty-four and a half thousand clay balls. Beautiful. Three three hundred eighty-three stacks to be exact.
Mm -hmm. Hey, Steven, I have a request. What would that be? Can you get me a bunch of obsidian? Oh, I can probably do that. Yeah, I'm, I'm just trying to add as many fail safes as possible. Bucket. 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 Bork it. Bork it. That's the one that's going the right way. Alright. Yeah, I'll head down and get you city. You just gotta give me a minute to get the fuck down there. So. Honestly, you might be better off just going to the end, because I need like a decent amount of obsidian. What am I supposed to be do about going to the end though? I can't place water. What, the obsidian pillars? Oh fuck, I see the nether, duh. <laughs> yeah, by the time I fly over there though, just eh. Yeah, whatever you think, Sassus. Yeah, I already have a place that I've been getting obsidian down here. So I have like I found one of those big like lava pools that I've just been uh, I place a water bucket down to start quarrying it. So. All right. Well, yeah. If you guys take a look at uh, my screen, <laughs> you'll see that. Uh. <laughs> Here's the pit. <laughs> Why are there so many fucking crafting tables? What the fuck? Because if you try to place a block. Oh no! I'm in the crafting table. <laughs> Why can't you just shift place it? Well, yes, but that's slower. Right there. I can tell you where you fought a fucking wither here, because there's just a giant crater. <laughs> yes. Oh shit, that was too high. Oh no! Oh no. It's fine, I'm gonna bone meal the area afterwards anyway, to make it look as natural as possible. Yep, and then surrounding the crafting tables... Uh, is obsidian. Uh, let's see here. Uh, behind the crafting tables is water. <gasps> so you try to break through the crafting tables? Oh no, now you're being flooded by water. <laughs> Man, you really want this person to fucking die, don't you? Look, when I make a trap, I, I need to make sure that trap will absolutely kill the person. When you make a trap, you don't plan on them living through said trap. Exactly. You yeah, know, if they live through the trap, then my trap has failed. So I guess I'm probably clear to start placing the punji sticks at this point. I cannot sleep as I am down. Getting obsidian. That's fine, I'm looking stuff up. Hmm. Man, even just looking at this pit, oh, it is nasty looking. <laughs> <laughs> All these, like, here's the thing it's like, you can kind of tell, like, maybe that has a potion effect, but it's like, ooh. Knowing that it's instant damage, too, is terrifying. Yeah. I can just leave all this dirt to despawn. I don't need it. <laughs> right? Like, nah.
Hey guys, and welcome back. This is Chosen Arctic today. We're diving back into some more. Go ahead and start a new conveyor line right <coughs> here. Um, it's lots of gears, lots of gears. Now, if I just don't know if I, up and over. Still, all right. Now at this scrolling point, through a 25 minute long to video to try and find what I'm looking for. It's all going <laughs> in the right direction. It should send the nugget for at, at the moment. Um, so we have just about everything. And I need to send this down. <laughs> I didn't mean to lose my backpacks and everything. Like my back raining the lava from over here. Log. And this makes a brass chin. For, for picking up stuff and I also don't craft up this What's that? Um, but we do need pipes in order to connect to this to have a pipe network now there's a lot of different things that we have that um, supports auto filling from JEI so that's pretty awesome like that it supports that um, but we do need pipes in order to connect to this to have a pipe network now there's a lot of different things that we have here that um, are a part of pipe networks. Like all these different things control our pipes. And then we need a pipe wrench, which is gonna be a bit of iron. Uh, I think, what was it, three, three iron and then a flower or a rose bush, either way. So there we go. And uh, last but not least, just a pipe, basically one of the pipes we have. Okay, so that's going to allow us to configure everything. Let's see if I can't set up a little area to work on this. So I'm hoping this works uh, in a way where if we have drawers or if anything connected to it, and we connect pipes to this, and then we connect the controller to it, then we can access the things that are in this. So if I throw five in there, they don't exactly show up. Oh, they do show up. Okay, so that does work. Um, so, and we do have options here, order amount, descending, and JEI search. Okay. Wow, this is going to be fantastic then. And then, I'm guessing... How much obsidian do you need, Kaiser? Uh, a little bit. Okay, uh, I'm dumping two and a quarter stacks in the storage right now. Uh, that actually... That was a lot more than I was expecting to get that quickly, damn. Um, hamburger burr. That might be enough, actually. Yeah, give me a second here, and I'll show you my uh, strategy for mining obsidian and how I get it so quickly. So I go up, I go up to like here, uh, where I'm gonna start, and I go to like I go, I'm gonna do three at a time. So I'm gonna go to this one right here. I break this one right here. Place water. Breaks the blocks around it. So this will give us access to what is called a pipe pressurizer. So let's go ahead and test this out. So we pop that in there and we get the water kind of spills out to cover everything, and then I stand right over the source block and just break straight down. To keep this pressurized, and I bet this makes things go a bit faster. So I went ahead and made myself a sterling dynamo, and I can go ahead and chuck some logs in here. We have so much. And just go, and it gives me every time, single time my hammer breaks it, it's not, it's just clear. I can get up to like nine obsidian at, at a time. I can get, I get obsidian very quickly doing this. That makes it a bit much. You know, that's a good hammer you got there then, because yeah, it's like when I was using my hammer to break up, uh, like the obsidian pillars in the ends, um, it's like, it's like slow as shit. Yeah, because I have, um, netherite, uh, netherite, emerald, diamond, and then five levels of uh, the redstone, and uh, three of the parts are cobalt. Um, so I, I have the lightweight three. Uh, now, and actually, over here, pressure I should be placing torches because I have light speed uh, on this thing, arms are great, uh, uh, which makes it so uh, that uh, the higher, when I'm in higher light levels, I get more mining speed. Mm. Uh, so these tubes, so if I just can, place a uh, bunch of fucking torches around, so it's bright as fucking here always. Infrastructure. So there we go. The higher the light level I'm in, the more mining speed I get. So like right now, if I look, mining speed is 1784. If I go down here where it's dark, you go stand down here, over here. Uh, 
So are no, we so able to? Well, apparently, it doesn't actually apply. Are, are we going to be able? It does. To, it does. Well, like, actually, mine faster. It's kind of fucking nice. Lights? I've like For seen it in stuff. action. Oh man! I really so then I just come up here, pick up the water. Things instead of belts. Come over here. We're oh, gonna man, do this one get kind right. Of ridiculous. After actually, a while. we're gonna do so, it yeah, right there. So yeah, I decided to go ahead and get myself a sterling dynamo since these are so much easier. I think to set up and will last so much longer. Break the ones um, around this it. This is definitely going to be the way to go instead of lava at the moment for this particular setup. Yeah, lava, you, I'm sorry, but you just got to go. And I can and then rinse and increase repeat. this by taking out the hardened from here. I mean, lava, you'll be great once we have automation, but for right now, I think this is the way to go. Stick Ooh, that in almost there fell into the trap. <laughs> upgrade this with a hopper. All right. And and then, then you know for sure if it's working. Here. <laughs> and sure I'd rather not, to be honest, because I'm pretty sure it'll work going into this Fair. and that's going to last quite a while producing the same amount of power yeah, from all my testing the of the punji sticks earlier <laughs> ADR per tick. but yeah and, so uh, yeah, basically actually, what i have here is i have a pit as well does it uh filled with much. instant so, damage two we, spikes we at the bottom so that's mm -hmm. a good thing Man, everything today, like the entire pit is surrounded in crafting tables day, but oh you can't ask creeper we got quite a bit done now i have to of course repair the pit a huge shout out <laughs> to the sponsor of today's video and where can i go ahead and place Ooh, actually that could be a lot more oh my god fun. and i want to say a huge thanks by the way to hey guys, guys, another... hey guys why are there so many just... fucking creepers oh my god is there is apparently i don't know what the fuck all right well i'll have to make the area more natural looking anyways eventually so whatever yeah so just like that, just from that little expo, show you how I do stuff. That's just that was just <laughs> shy of two stacks of obsidian. So. Okay, so anyways, before those two fucking creepers were so rude. So, the crafting tables are a stalling tactic, because uh, you can't place blocks on them. You have to shift to place them. Yeah. Which that'll be ever so slightly slower, or extremely slower, if the person in the trap uh, doesn't realize they have to shift click to place a block. <clears> hmm. <throat> Um, mate, why are there so many enemies? Fuck me. Welcome to the mischief. I'm Valen, and, and then is surrounding the crafting tables well, noticed, is obsidian this is and water. So if you stuff, break the anyway, crafting tables, uh, water will flow into the room. With this, because it's mm -hmm. a little bit more mm -hmm. complex, but once you grab the, the uh, how much damage the basics six, of it, you, it's you not probably that bad didn't even need to uh, fucking so, I'd go to these the extents pipes. It's a basic Probably. Because you act like May has like our armor. In my mind gives it a really good reason for iron. <laughs> yes, bars. you're probably Plus, right, well, but you see. So, uh, how do you do it? You when I make a trap, the ground, you put it down. <laughs> you commit to it. Exactly. Inventories nearby, whether it be a chest or something like a furnace or whatnot, should automatically connect. That's pretty much it. So yeah, there the you go. Uh, there's now 123 obsidian in the system plus well. what you have. Oh, you could have used the crying obsidian. The pipes and so we have 334 of that. To disconnect these two pipes, I could have. I just right Honestly, click. I just That's see no crying problem. obsidian as like a non-existent thing. I just right click on the side that I want to reconnect it. There I'm gonna we go. Quick. It's that simple. Yeah, get rid of this rain, all the mobs. There we go. I do want it to connect. Oh, well, looks like I'm going to have to go around the other side of this pipe. So there is some... Some... You know restrictions on there, but anyway, if I sneak Walking right, rain. Click, I will pick up okay. the pipe. Oh, fuck. Do I have any of these upgrades? Oh, I don't have, have any of these logs. At the same okay, time, we'll automatically pick those oh, up. Somebody fucking upgrades, creepers. You say? Fuck. I know, right? That's the next part. This is how you actually make your system do stuff. No, you're like you're seeing here, I currently have uh, wood being fed. Oh yeah, Julian. Um, another here, way to get modifier slots charcoal, on your tools, which, uh, the upgrade slots. Mm -hmm. Um, making up making parts out of rose gold. Each part made out of rose gold will give you another upgrade slot. Mm. Makes rose gold really good. Yeah, I'm currently watching one specifically on the pretty pipes. Mm. Which I have going into here, which Seen. is where I have a whole bunch of iron ore. And then mm. the charcoal is also being fed in here, here, as well as iron, and it's it's auto-smelting over here, and then recycling back on itself. It, it's a crazy setup, but I'm, I'm doing this to prove and show you guys what there is to go on. So... Upgrades. You'll need blank modules to start. Recipe is basic, and then you'll need to upgrade it from there, which can get quite expensive, especially if this is like kind of a vanilla plus type yeah, I'm atmosphere. Trying to like just wanted to naturify the area, make some stuff without so creating a giant vanilla. Did we get to do a lot of small plate. Um, 
Oh, so, I made that a while ago, I'm pretty yes, sure. You can yeah. see the, the black. And then I realized, like, it was like shit but or let, something. Let's like start that. off with. That you realize that the manual is just better. <laughs> yeah. Not all. Some upgrades don't even have those. That is one, two, and three, right? And if they are actually moving any items, they are likely only going to move one at a time for the lowest setting, eight at a time for the second setting or medium, oh, and six fuck, I have to wait for all this dirt to grow. Son of a or bitch. High that fucking mode, creeper. Or high filter <laughs> mode. Or priorities. We've got all sorts of crazy stuff over here. These ones here are going to be, kind of be separate from these ones here. And I will show you why in a moment. Let's start off with more basic stuff. Extraction modules. These are really, really nice to use. Uh, in fact, you know if mobs can now. trigger the broken Let's sound put some here, to break? and then I'll put a chest down uh, there. That I don't know. So we've got pipe. Fuck. Pipe, so I don't want to set pipe. this up then until no, I, I right actually. Pipe, no, I don't think they can because I've had zombies right and right shit now, walk over but me while I'm dealing. This like one, walk right up to you while I'm dealing. Crack stone. Same thing with this one. So I'm almost positive they can. Right next to and even shifting over it, it doesn't break. Good. Right next to and yeah, shifting over it, it doesn't break. Good. Because it actually has this little connection, you know, to it. If you don't want it to connect, you can disconnect it, and then right-clicking doesn't do anything anymore because there is no inventory. For right, it get out my carpet. This is gonna by. look like grass this is where now. You put said upgrades <laughs> to change the behavior of the pipes. It's so like it doesn't look like grass, module, but it looks enough like grass that here, if you're not paying attention, extract, if I if yeah. you look here, the tools <laughs> you might just walk info. over it's it. Honestly, may will probably see it, get curious, and walk from adjacent inventory. Filters and pole rails. Works for me. To be honest here. High tier, like in all honesty. high tiers prevent oversending. So if you know, here, I'm sure Julian would agree. Then things in here will be sent over there automatically, right? Maybe. You got to see what this thing so is set for. Right now, here. nothing is disallowed. I'm trying to learn how to use these. Nothing is allowed. There's Get the good scrub. So <laughs> what I'm working on. Anything will go, or nothing <laughs> will go. You can also filter uh, those. For I instance, if I take here? some... Actually, let's take granite in this case. We're going to have granite is going oh, to be allowed, but I'm also going to grab regular stone. And you know, I think so I'm just going to fill in here. Nothing any and all blocks in here. that it should go. There aren't it goes. grass Down yet with away, One at a time, and it'll fill in here in the first place. I can't be bothered to wait this long. Just like that. So, yeah. You can filter things. Oh, yeah, and the best like part is with all the like nature and shit around here, you can just like you can already tell that it's going to be harder to see. That's it. Yeah, you're At gonna see it until you run up to it. Module. But exactly. the problem is, it's not Maybe necessarily funny going to go if you in the direction you want. It. You might have. Oh, I'm being very fucking careful about connections that. or all sorts <laughs> of things going on, and then everything out of here. These granite blocks are going to go into. It might be a little into, sus because uh, there's not really any tall grass in this biome. But I'm going to leave the tall grass just because they're going to need to do a little bit. Make it a little more dangerous. In this case, yeah. Let's actually take this back out. And it will save its data. So if I put this over in this one and insert it here, it will actually uh, keep the same information. I had cleared it just by right-clicking on that because it just stores a ghost of the item. It doesn't actually use the item in this case. Um, but the recipe for these ones is pretty basic. Oh, uh, I absolutely these, love though you know, that it's like the second that I found out that I like, touch broken stone, my mind again, just instantly went to this but, is I mean, how I make the punji sticks. <laughs> whatever your, uh, floats your boat there. This I is how I commit to die. Just because, as it says here, uh, high tiers prevent Time over to sending. More crimes. So if I have this going into here, and I only want to send like I mean it's not even that it only far has from our house, one inventory slot and that slot mm -hmm. is almost full. Everything will keep on sending over here one at a time. You'll have like four or five of them in this pipe. Then it'll bounce out of here once it's full and bounce back into this inventory. So it will prevent that from happening. It will say, okay, there's enough space for X amount to go in there, and then it will send the uh, required amount, whether it be eight or sixteen. Therefore, I, pr I recommend you at least upgrade it to the level 2s, just so you can avoid that oversending thing. Oh, look now, there at are this. other ways of getting around that, it's but like, that's just the beginning. You can barely leave until the trap is there. So let's go with retrieval <laughs> modes. These here are very expensive. Uh, and then you go into level 2 and level 3. And this it's is just for one of them. It. And these are often used on a lot of inventories. So... If I put this, oh, here, thank you, lavender forest, for just having it's gonna grass and fucking flowers everywhere. <laughs> lower retrieval module. It is going to retrieve items from nearby inventories. If we put these in here. Nothing's going to happen because I actually need to tell it what to retrieve. In this case, I want only granite. So let's do this and this, and then you just wait a moment, and there it goes. The granite is going to go over into the chest. 
and this will allow you a certain level of specialization. So if you have a lot of inventories or a lot of things going on, where you need oh, you know in one stone I, I, in another, I, I'm feeling very in the third, I, whatever. You can actually separate. Them I'm gonna out take a screenshot like if you so desire. And I'm gonna like now that's caption it like manner. I'm gonna write spot the that, Viet Cong soldier like or something like that. It, and then I can <laughs> go back over here and remove the retrieval module. There we go. And again, you can also upgrade these to different levels. I showed you those, and it's just really, really cool how this, you know, so far can work. It's similar to the old logistics pipes mod, and I think that was the inspiration for it. So I was understanding that coming along, Julian. Really. A little, little bit more, a little bit more uh, uh, challenging to, to use. Restricts flow from pipes into adjacent inventories. Filter amount varies by tier, so you can actually add filters as to what goes into an inventory. So if I have, in this case, an extraction oh, module and a low filter module. It's so good. Let's put an extraction module over here and it's going to allow uh, everything, right? Or disallow nothing. Well, uh, allow nothing, disallow nothing. Well, oh, whatever. All right, time disallow to nothing. unload the area. Okay. So therefore, everything Although that goes actually in here probably should won't go unload, into the other one. Yep, All right, the granite yeah, is going over. I'm going to grab that, but let's make it so that there's a filter. We're going to put this in here, and we're going to say that stone is disallowed. All right, fine. Well, actually, let's make it so that instead of stone, we'll because we've already seen granite go over there. We'll have granite be disallowed, and we'll toss granite in, and it stays stone, and it goes. Ah. See, so this is another way that you can uh, kind of customize these as you want. Instead of having this end pull, you can have this end push and this end filter, or however many ends that you want to filter. And that's how the filter modules more or less work. And yes, you can change these to be such. Uh, I, if you change it, you know, mid t mid term, it, it might be a little bit weird. But for now, there we go. Turning that off. Damn, Ready yeah, there's just through. so much lag yeah, on our base. Jesus update. Christ. Nice. <laughs> Take these back out so that they don't... It's like I flew in here and I have. could visibly see Take my frames out, dropping. And this out. <laughs> yeah. And we can continue on with what my we've got. My frames usually so, sit pretty decent. The filter modules have extra options that you can add in. Yeah, my so, computer example, is definitely like aging a little bit. These filter modules. Yeah, sure. Put it in here. It's been I like... A couple spots God, I think it was like at least four years since I last upgraded it. And that is adding in a damage filter modifier, a data filter modifier, or a tag filter modifier. Now, damage filter modifier, any filter slots to filter by item damage. So if I have a bow that's been shot a few times, it could say, I don't want that. I only want perfect bows. So therefore, you can have your damaged bows that are coming from a mob farm go into a trash bin or a lava pit. And you can have the other stuff going into uh, a, a crate where you keep the stuff. Uh, or you just have all things that so have you do it, Steven. get trash. Making and another tree farm. Magic books. Another one? Something along those lines, yep. just to give an example. Now, uh, what else we have? Why do we need another module one? Causes any filter uh, another one over data. here to automate so the like, fucking slabs. If I have uh, three bows that are perfect. Alright, so... Lo what Logan told me was stupid and bullshit. <laughs> we do not need pumps to run these. You need modules to tell it how to work. So the pipes can be even more just sleek and efficient. Yeah. Back back to the top. Gonna have to make a little bit of brass so that I can get my thing done. Because I'm actually out of brass. Uh, I thought I had more radial chests. And then go from there. Yippee. Glad I actually looked it up. <laughs> okay, it was what? Copper and uh, zinc to make the brass? Right? Something like that. Uh, what the fuck is that block called?
Mm -hmm. Yeah, I just realized I don't have my music bot running. had some brass in this thing but yeah. it still wasn't quite enough should be more than enough to fill the last bit of this. Hmm. At least I have a lovely pillar of uh, gears and shafts that I can break down to replace the uh, fucking pumps. Nice. There we go. Now nah, I got some brass coming. It looks like with the pipes you can still do a lot of like filtering and stuff. Yeah. So it it uh, for some systems it will just be more feasible to use that than the uh, conveyors. Okay, I got that now. Let's go ahead and break down some of this bullshit. Yeah, I like how easy it is to not run out of wood with, the, like, just having this tree farm here. <laughs> it's like whenever I need wood, I just go grab, like, two inventory fulls, just throw it into the storage. Oh yeah, another fun fact about this system. You do not need uh, any power to run it. It's slow without power, but uh, you don't need it, essentially. Yeah. Understandable. To the top. Might have to move the chest around, but we'll figure out as I get up there. Point is, now I have a straight fucking shot to the surface. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck, 
I need a pipe wrench. Eh. Unless the normal one would work, but I don't think so. Yeah, no. Okay, that, that. I need red dye. Fuck. Mm. Fuck you! Makes red die. Damn, that's a lot of phantoms. Get a bunch on you. Yeah, I got like three. What the fuck is the skeleton shooting me from? Oh, right there. This bitch. I don't think I have anything that makes red die. any red flowers around my area. Yeah, all I got is those damn lavenders. Yeah. Mm. Try to think. Can someone hop in bed? Because then I can go journey looking for just a single fucking red flower. Yeah, I'll get it. That way Kaiser doesn't have to sleep because he's trying to keep the phantoms on him. Yeah. It's the more phantoms that are on him a night, the more... Hey, okay. there's the farmer's set. Nice. Just the fucking random set left. What the... Oh, you bloody skeleton. Yeah, if you want to come grab the Farmer's Delight set, it should be in there. Yeah, I'll get it then. wasn't too long. Yay, I got red dye. Nice. That's so if we're going the... to one of the forests would find something, but, you know. Yeah, so what does the Farmer's Delight Metal give again? Uh, like, stuff, a hug or stuff or whatever. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna separate the base set and the BYG sets. Okay. Cause yeah, the chest is full at this point. There we go. That's disconnected now. Uh, let's see. I have no fucking emeralds left in this system. Really? 
Guys, are you at the house? Uh, yeah, what's up? Can you throw, uh, get two emeralds and chuck them in the system, please? So I can craft a upgrade. Yeah, uh, that's if the villagers are ready, because I did just trade with them a little bit ago. There we go, look at that. I just need two. Nice. You get 12. That works for me. Thank you, sir. Now, the pressurizer is not needed, but definitely uh, it does speed things up. Yeah. All right. That's one problem made a lot easier. So, yes, now I will suggest item pipes. <laughs> uh, from what I've saw, it looks like uh, the base level, which is at brass level, is one item per, uh, like, so many ticks. Yeah. Uh, the middle speed is eight, and then the fastest is 16. Nice. Yes. All you need to do is uh, to get it to work. Uh, look at my screen real quick so I can show you this. Yep, I'm already looking. All right. So you go to the side that's connected, and you right-click it, and in here you can put stuff. These brass modules you make into other things. Yeah. Um, so if like I go to at pretty pipe, it makes all these. All yeah. you need is on the end that is taking it out of a chest to put one of mm -hmm. the low or one of the extraction modules. Uh, okay. Now, if you want to have it filtered at like where you're sending it, you have yeah. to make the retrieval module and then it will allow you to tell it what it's allowed to accept. Uh, I see. Yes. And this does work with, like, it has its own crafting terminal and stuff. Uh, yeah. From my understanding, it works with, like, the JEI system. Like, you can search for items and have it pull. Yeah. I can't really explain that bit, though. <laughs> Alright, Steven, by my calculations, we're missing three of the secret cards. Three? That's assuming that there's only 27 cards in the set. Yeah. Which is a full assumption. Because, yeah, the highest card we have is a 27. So, yeah, we're missing 2, 15, and 18. Okay. Okay, now that that's done, that's a lot easier. Um... I wonder how much... Uh, liquid it takes to count it as an infinite source. That I don't know. Because I might just make myself a lava source. Yeah, I don't know off the top of my head what that number would be. Let's go here. Create above and beyond. Infinite source. Fucking stuck on belts. Wait. Shit. 
fucking annoying to get around sometimes. Okay, so it's 10,000 source blocks. God damn. Wait, what are you trying to make? An infinite lava pool in the uh, overworld? Yeah, you got you ain't fine to getting that. <laughs> what do you uh, mean? If you want to sit there and make that by hand, you have at it, but I can think of way better ways All to I fucking... have to do to get it to work is I have to make the area for it, and then I use a hose pulley to fill. Fair. Mm-hmm. But still, I don't know if it'd be worth the fucking time. I'd rather just, like... Because oh, later on, you later on you can get the uh, ender tanks anyways, and uh, they let you... They, you can color them and set, use them to send liquids across like from one tank to another across dimensions wouldn't you have to have someone in the oh my god though, fucking kidnap uh technically yeah but you should use a chunk loader they're cheap as fuck to make mm -hmm. let me see shit out of me when i get kidnapped by fucking tank i guess that's not too bad the problem is is the more that we use them the more lag it can create. Yeah. Not that's gonna make a difference if I do it there or have a lava pool here. <laughs> yeah. Why in the fuck? Are we out of andesite? I'd be damned oh, if we're out of andesite. Mm. Oh well. We've got plenty of andesite alloys, I'm not overly concerned about it. Um. Let's see, so to make that, we need this, which for that's an ender pearl and obsidian. So you have to use an induction smelter with enderminium ignit and inductive mechanism. Jesus fuck. Let's see, Endermanium Ignit. How the fuck? How do you even get the Endermanium? The Enderium. Enderium, uh, stuff. Uh, that's a late game shit. Like I said, it's it's yeah, late game. Yeah, but how? I don't even fucking know. Everything I'm seeing looks like it's coming from itself. Yeah, which means that there's gonna be some fucky shit that you have to do uh, later on. Okay, it looks like it's induction uh, smelter with tall posy bush, poise bush, whatever, uh, silver ignit, and either ender pearl or four ender dust. Should go back to the end and grab some of those then. I didn't realize that they had use. What is it? The poise bush. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm assuming you can probably, uh, there's probably a way to automate them now. Looks used like for... it's, uh, I don't know if it's just creating it or if it's like making more out of nothing. But from what yeah. I'm seeing, it's the Phytogenic isolator. You use just the no normal poise bush, put it in with water, and have it powered, and it will uh, make the tall poise bush. Yeah. I don't know if it gets rid of the old one, like if you have to farm them and then put them in, or if it's like I don't know how it works yet. Yeah. Mm, I'm gonna have to go to the bathroom here. Here, let me get myself to the shack. I'll put my. Or actually, no, I'll just disconnect. Who the fuck am I kidding? <laughs> I'll be right back. Don't get me banned. Make no promises. Actually, going to change how this goes because we're gonna do that, and then I'm pretty sure I've got some gearboxes over here already. 
Yeah, there they are. One of these needs to be horizontal. And it's that one right there. Please be the fuck. It's not what I want. What the fuck? Oh, god damn it. Phantoms. Nope. Kind of not an ideal place to fight them, to be honest. Mm -hmm. Ebola. Apparently, I failed to turn off my microphone. <laughs> huh? I always hit it before I walk out the room. Yeah. Do, do, do. That's if you ever hear my door, it's because I somehow managed to double click that. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Alright, now we're just going to. All that shit out onto there and just let it pick up as it goes because I'm not. I accidentally broke a thing and. Hit it with the sword, man! It drops more! <laughs> well, I'm trying out the tactic where you put the thing in your offhand. So you're still holding the, uh, the item with the luck on it. Yeah. Uh. Ow! Also, they were never coming down, so... Oh, sure. oh yeah, and you can't fly because you're too far away from the beacon. Mm -hmm. Alright, I guess it's time to go down through here. What are you attacking me for? System. I slept... I slept recently, you little twat. Fuckers going after me. I got two. I just dumped in the system. Right. It's weird going back and actually picking up all this. Woo! I just about killed myself on the souls by accident. Because a fucking belt kidnapped me. Yo, that's actually cool as shit. Look what? at this. Oh, yeah, that is cool. Fuck <laughs> off, zombie. Quit being a cunt and leave me alone. I'm just that going down, do breaking shit. down the old conveyor, and I'm like, oh, shit, nice. I figured no point in wasting resources and leaving this behind. Yeah. Not that I don't have infinite now, but, you know. To be fair, with me having set up this system, it was definitely needed at one point. Yeah because the items all take brass to even make.
Only problem with it is it seems to take from like different sections at once. So like it, it never, it's not gonna take as it's coming in, if that makes sense. Yeah. So it's not just the random, it could be sending one, all of one item for a while. Which I think is why we need the uh, faster ones. Let's see. Are you able to make me an Invar machine? Invar... maybe? Do you have the stuff for the inductive yet? Uh, I think... Let me check. You'll have to give me a minute to check. Alright. If you're able to, that'd be amazing. How do you set up these machines to get the saplings again? To get the oh. saplings? Yeah, to pull the saplings, like, into You're the, You're supposed uh... to do it automatically. Oh, this fucking thing connected and deposited all the fucking saplings. Yeah. Yeah, no, the portable storage will steal the saplings, so you kind of have to place, like, the ones after it manually. Yeah, yeah do when it's gonna... starting off, it's a little rough, but, uh, once it gets going, it keeps up with everything. Yeah. Damn, that's fast. What did you do for it? Uh, I used the fan. Ah. Uh. Huh. So, yeah, I think I can make this a little bit bigger. I'm not sure, though. Well, I mean, I mean if it's if just I... for, like, wood and stuff, I doubt that you need to. Yeah, it, all it's doing is it's just gonna go get it's just gonna go get sawed down into saplings. Yeah. So. so if I tell this, I need a brass funnel. Which I think I've already got one. Or not. I guess I don't. I guess I gotta make some. Okay. Oh, that's right. I used my last one. My last. So, we'll just make... Make some this more. This room feels so open now. <laughs> it's weird. Come over here. I need one log. <laughs> I forgot. I have a proper windmill down here. Oh? Yeah, look at that. It's going the wrong way, though. But, oh well. gonna encase this room. Sure. So now if I do that. I need to wrench these to have them go the other way. There we go. Now random mobs are less likely to just randomly jump down at you. These are supposed to feed into each other, right? The saws. Turn the direction of the, uh... Oh, I know what you're messing up. The first one strips it. Fucking sh Really? Yeah. Well, first I, one's, I have a... You need three set up. Uh, one strips, one turns into planks, and one turns into slab. So if I clear that? No, it's, it's not even moving through doing anything. Like it's it could just... also be going the wrong way. Yeah, I th I'm gonna try. Let me. Let me try going around and placing them on the other side like this. I believe it's based on the rotation. Okay, so I need to get the rotation spun around. Got it. 
So if I yeah. break these two. What you can do is turn where that vertical gearbox is going, so have it go to the right and then have a gearbox coming off it coming forward. Yeah. Oh, but wait, then it will connect to that conveyor belt next to it. Yeah. Mm. Um, I got an idea. So we're gonna do this. I still need that these this can that works because I need it to spin that way. Um so, uh, I need to make some more gearboxes. There we go. Now this place is perfectly sealed off from everything. If I place these down, bang and bang. So, I crush my water bottles before throwing them away because it takes up less space. Yeah. But while I'm streaming, I won't crush them because that's just too much hassle to mute constantly for that and makes too much noise for me to just crush out mic. Yeah. So I've just got this pile of bottles here waiting for me to crush after stream. <laughs> oh my There's God. currently what? five sitting there. Why can't I not pull shit off a fucking saw? That is so fucking stupid. Yeah. What the... Well, either way, like <laughs> I told you, you're not going to get it done that way. You need a third. I'm going to try it anyways because I'm stubborn. <laughs> Go right ahead. <laughs> oh my god, I hate the fact that the belts fucking kidnap you. Like, they suck you in. Well, that's part of why I was looking at the other alternatives. Because uh, my plan is I'm going to essentially have, like, certain buildings are going to be just for, like, there's going to be buildings for specific things, but then if it needs to pass to another building, it's going to have an item pipe. Yeah. Or to, like, gather all of the, uh, resources at the end. You know, it's still not going, like, even whenever I'm leaving, it's just stopping. Mm. Oh, wait a second. I just realized I, it didn't actually flip the rotational force. I'm a fucking idiot. <laughs> I, need, I need to change the rotational force again. Where the fuck did that thing go? Steve, got a wall. No. Fuck <laughs> you. I love that he just popped in for that only. Mm -hmm. There we go. I need that. Which means that I need to do... Uh, this. And that. And I can do two chain drives here. Two. And then hopefully this fucker will be working. Do oh that. my god. And then that. Okay, fine, I'll make a third soul since you thing's fucking stupid. <laughs> the fat why does it strip? That makes no fucking sense. I don't have to strip a log to craft planks out of it. I think it's based more on real life on that part. It still doesn't make fucking sense. Oh my god, Steven, we're missing one card from the BYG set now. Oh my god. <laughs> Is that the last one you need, or is there another pack yet? No, this is the last set we need. We've gotten all the others. So is it literally just picking it up that lets you get the thing? Yeah. Weird. You just have to get them all. Literally, if you paid us enough coins, we could literally let you just come over That's and pick up all of ours. <laughs> 
If I ever decide that I want it, you know. Mm hmm. I must just want to know what the fucking effect is for getting the medal. That's what I want. <laughs> <laughs> the BYG one. Yeah. Yeah. What does the BYG stand for? No idea. Oh. We got no fucking clue. Bring your guns, maybe? <laughs> What kind of cards does it have in it? Uh, let's see. Mud, Maple, Gapple, Red Rock, Frostling, Holly, Lignot, Lily, Synth. This sounds like a bunch of uh, plants. Cricklina, uh... Root, Shade, Ashes, Light, Cryptic Fire, <laughs> Ebony Black, <laughs> Theorem, <laughs> Green, <laughs> Sorrow, uh, Jacaran, Nardara, Sakura, Ember, Enchantress, Tall, Amy T, Penny D. I know an Amy. Imagine knowing an Amy. That's a cringe. Yeah, I don't know. Like, the thing that makes me so nervous is that it's like... The odds of me getting this one specific card... Out of the random pack is so fucking low. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, did you, uh, ever check if you have the stuff for the Envar machine? Um, let me look and see. Invar machine, no, that's what I'm actually starting to work towards for the induct. I'm starting okay. to go towards those radiant induction coils. That'll be what I start doing after I get this Saul bullshit figured out. That's uh, that's why I need to make the one that is a little bit faster. The last one is the Enderium. Yeah. So if I do chain, chain, and Problem chain. with mixing sage with your cigarette. Because it's, uh, like a different material. Yeah. Or possibly just different moisture level. It causes weird burning. Yeah. So let's see. Put, put this there. That there. So that next there. That. Oh, yeah. I just need to get the stuff actually in it. Let's take this guy, throw him down. I very rarely need the uh, gear shifts, so I'm not putting them in my uh, toolbox. Yeah. Toolbox is handy, though. I've been using it a lot. Let's see, I need to grab those. I think I put them in here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and I need a bucket of lava. Where did my bucket go? The fuck? I know I got another one, but where'd the one I had go? Oh, it's in there. It's just got water in it. Steven, could you sleep so my villagers will restock their trades? Yeah. Holy fucking phantoms. <laughs> Hang on, let me deal with these guys first. <laughs> <laughs> back here. Nope, nope. Get the fuck back here. You went flying away. Just try to keep getting them to restock their trade so you can buy more yep. emeralds. Yep. Look, we're one card away from finishing the set. <laughs> yeah. Getting everything fucking done. I fuck, I didn't grab lava. And it really is just curiosity at this point that dictates that I must go further. <laughs> Ow, mm. fuck you, Saul, that hurt.
Oh fuck, this isn't powered for some reason. Is it overstressed? No, it's just not connected somewhere. Oh. Apparently something I did has this going too fast now. Cool. Damn, those ones a shot, I tried. Uh, which means I can do this the bullshit way, which is that, that, and that. And then funnel. Just a an regular old andesite funnel will work. Bang! There we go. Slabs are being automatically crafted. So that's automated and we don't have, ever have to worry about it anymore. God damn, making this fucking zinc stuff is a pain. Yeah. Mm, do I even need any right now? I don't think I do. Ow! Fuck. I kidnapped by the sawmill again. Let's see, zinc machine. I guess the only thing I would want it for is that mega torch. I know I want some of the other stuff at some point, but... Do you know what the nullifier does? The what? Nullifier. Oh, no. Got no fucking clue. Damn. I'm bitching me to go to bed and the two of them are still over there in chat. Fuck you. <laughs> I guess I'm just gonna skip this stuff for now because I don't think I really need any of the zinc stuff. Yeah. So let's see. On to ch or wait, no, that's right. I got other stuff I do want to do. I want to basically reconstruct my entire system. <laughs> <laughs> that's how I want to start building actual like buildings for everything. By the way, Julian, do you think I have enough redstone? No. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so I've got the steel plates I want in here. Or tiles, I mean. Actually, let's check that first. Christ. <laughs> Alright. I'm going to do myself a favor here. And I'm going to change my create barrels over to uh, shoulder boxes. Ah. Um, so, one's going to be all fluid shit. The orange one's going to be fluid shit. Uh... This can go in the fluid shit. Uh, cop anything copper just goes into fluid shit automatically. Red, we're gonna wait to get the uh, laboratory tiles. Hmm. 
Hello, random windmill bearing. How are you doing today? Uh, it is amazing just how quickly I go through wood with making sticks to sell for emeralds. Yeah. <laughs> the problem is I don't know what I want to use for walls. But I don't yeah. want to use any of the, uh, like, wood because of any- if I use lava. Yeah. He's kind of on there, second nose, second nose. Actually, wait, those one one in here. Uh, mechanical crafters can go in here, as can that and that. Actually, no, shoot goes in here. There we go. Everything's put in fucking shulker boxes. <laughs> So now I can move, I can pick shit up, I can just pick these fuckers up, and move them around as I need them, instead of having to climb over shit to get to things. <laughs> I can come over here, let's place down my shulker boxes. I have my shit more on. tunnels. Oh shit, Steven. <laughs> what? I've made so many fucking mystery buddy card packs that I've used all the iron blocks in the system. I'll get more. <laughs> this is... This is uh, let's see here. There's 457 over here, so I'll grab two stacks out and chuck them in the system. We're down to 329. Oh no. <laughs> You're just, this. Hmm? you're just bound and fucking determined to get that. Uh, it's one card. I know. You just want it so bad. You want it. Do I not have any of these drawers? I could have sworn I had a couple. Hmm, I guess not. Damn. Indubitably. And do I have any more zinc? Well, I got un I got the uh, crush thing, so I can make some. All right, guess I'm making more zinc. Had a phantom membrane, no. <laughs> oh, I didn't get it. God damn it. <laughs> Rest in pepperoni. One fucking card. I hate it. <laughs> There's a thing in occultism called a surprisingly substantial statue. I'm assuming it just has a lot of fucking storage space. Maybe. I don't know. I haven't used that. God, if feels so nice to just have those two things in just fully f everything about them is oh. it's like orgasmic oh yes it's beautiful just look at a fucking storage and see two those two thousand electron tubes oh my god how much oh, pain yeah. they caused <laughs> it's so fucking beautiful. Like, handcrafting those fuckers is a pain in the ass. So to be able to just look at it. I got 2,000 of Kaiser left the game. Yeah. I don't have any more stuff to continue making packs, so... Hmm. I've decided that that is where I will... Stop. 
Fair enough. What you should what you should have done is what you should do is you just like sit AFK for like an hour and play something else and let Julian and I sleep so that you just get more and more phantoms spawning on you. Uh, yeah, sure. I'll go AFK in the, one of the two nether farms. Yeah. yeah. I, I I haven't actually checked though to see if the uh be, the the, the nether fun. counts. Um, otherwise, if it, we don't know for sure, I'd say to AFK at the gunpowder farm. Mm, the problem is the gunpowder farm isn't set up to hold stuff properly right now. Yeah, it'll fill up. It'll fill up and then fuck the server. Yeah, I'm gonna probably AFK at the gold farm. Cause yeah. Uh, if I do need more buddy card packs, the easiest way to get is just to give gold to Pigmen, so... You know, it's, it's, it's funny, I completely forgot about the fact that I, uh, moved when the server restarts. So, I was just like, oh, there's not much point in AFK, because I'll just restart in, like, three hours anyways. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, no, it's not going to be restarting until, like, 10, so. I don't know what happened with my wood farm, but it started sending through stuff that's not supposed to be. Interesting. So the uh, souls are actually more efficient. Um, the souls are actually more fucking efficient than just straight crafting. Yes. Um... Because one, normally if you craft a log into planks, it gives you four planks, but if you saw it, it gives you six planks. And then each plank gives you two slabs, so you're effectively getting 12 slabs out of one log. Very, very interesting. to the gold farm I go. Yeah, I don't know what happened with my wood farm, but it somehow was putting everything, like, past the saws. So, like, sticks and such were on there. I don't know how or where it managed to do that. It looks like it must have cut down a tree and not collected it. Because there's stuff up here, too. Weird. Okay, I was coming over here. Else I came to the uh, the gold farm. Yep, still so much shit here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, actually, because I had unloaded the chunks, uh, stuff that was here at the gold farm actually hasn't been uh, stored properly. Mm. Not just I'm too tired for this, I should maybe see if I could figure out a better solution than hoppers, because hoppers are slow as shit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, shoots are the quickest for just depositing. Um, the question is, is what are you doing with it? Just collecting mob drops. Mm. Oh, and I'm assuming you're using water to push it? No, it's the nether. Uh, what are you using to get it to the hopper then? Uh, their own stupidity. <laughs> At that point, I would suggest just using shoots. Uh, can shoots go horizontally? Mm. Ish. 
Let because me... how the how the farm works is there's a platform of hoppers that collects the mob drops when they fall onto the platform. <clears throat> this is the closest to horizontal that does. Interesting. So you can't saw you can't saw all shit down into planks. It's fucking okay. weird. Sir. I need to be actually horizontal. <sighs> you know, uh as tease as it would be, my suggestion would be to use conveyor belts to push them all to one spot and then use the chute. Uh, the... It might not be too tedious, it's just that it'll take me a minute to set up is all. Yeah. Because I actually have space up here, unlike in the other place. Yeah, and the reason I asked if you were using water is because water, fun fact, does not deposit into chutes. I found it out thanks to my lovely uh, pigeon farm here. <laughs> Go, little fucker. <laughs> okay, what did I need? Oh, yeah, I needed a fan. I'm setting up a system to make me some bricks, because I'm going to use bricks for the walls. Mm. Yeah, uh... Alright, got belts. I need, I believe they're called shafts. Yes, they are. You need a radial chassis. You definitely need sound a tired. I'm very tired. Yeah. Yeah. I'm also, I'm also trying yeah. to be quiet because my parents are sleeping. So. Mm. I'll be heading to bed before too long myself. Nice. Do be getting late. fans in here somewhere, because I had a shit ton. Thank you. Okay. Oh god, I just realized I have to fucking mob-proof all the goddamn things. <laughs> oh, like stuff breaking stuff. Uh, no, just like making it so mobs don't spawn there so it doesn't affect the uh, spawn rate of the farm. Okay. Let's see, I think I need to turn this. Wait, how do you do the diagonal shoots? Oh, uh, the ones, uh, you're, you'll literally just place it against another chute. So, wait. So you can't... Oh, you, okay, I yeah, see. Yeah, you place one down and then you set it on the side of another chute and it'll do it. And it looks like it can collect from both sections, oddly enough. Actually, I don't even know if I need a diagonal shoot now that I think about it. You know. Yeah, no, I don't. Should just need a normal, typically. Okay, right here's where I was at. I need to set you down. Oh, nice. The uh, toolbox can hold more than a stack of an item, just so you know. It is nice. Yes, I just discovered it. <laughs> I'm gonna share my screen because I need to see if uh, you guys will know if this will work or not. All right, is that gonna work? Give me a second. Mm. 
So like you're having them all go into the center there? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna have them pull towards the yes. chute here that it deposits into there. Yeah, because having it next to it puts it directly in instead of like shooting it somewhere. So you're good. Okay, so this will work, all right. Yeah. Have we tested, do things take fall damage when they land on belts? They fucking better. <laughs> <laughs> I would test it before you go too much farther. Well, easiest way to test it is just to keep building. Because more pigment will spawn eventually, so... I was gonna say, you could always do, uh... Like, go into... Creative and just spawn a creature and push it. <laughs> Something will spawn eventually, it's fine. <laughs> It's larger than it needs to be. Oh well. Let's see. Got a feeling this is gonna be going the wrong way. And it is. Oh, but I do gotta push this forward first, anyways. I just realized, based on where I've got everything. So we need you, you, there we go, then come here, This thing. Um. <laughs> I also need a windmill bearing, don't I? Windmill. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so yes. Uh, actually, no. I should have it face the other way. There we go. Okay, so that's gonna have one here. But for now, we need X. One, yep. Okay, I need to run for gear shift. Huh. Having cleared out all the barley, I'm actually I actually have a red flower that happened to start growing. Nice. Going the wrong way. My slab bear my slab drawer is already full. Jesus Christ. So that's in that's the invar like semi automated. Um, up next, check that off. I'm 
glad that I'm setting up to actually get rid of a lot of my system. Yeah. Because <laughs> what I'm setting up now to make these bricks is going to be such a pain to go around. <laughs> Two. Perfect. Now I need. We'll say even right about here. Oh, smart. this window is retarded. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this window is so retarded. <laughs> It's going the wrong way. Son of a bitch. It's fast as fuck, though. Goddamn. The gunpowder farm is actually really fucking convenient because we're actually gonna need it for this chapter. Along with bone meal, but we have so many fucking bones, it's not even funny. Um, and ender pearls. <laughs> okay, so now I need to make a smart shoot. Let's see, that's flattened brass, a normal shoot, and what? Okay, mobs. Electrode, right? Something like that, yeah. Yeah, the mobs do die when they fall on the conveyor belt. Okay. Good. <laughs> oh, fucking Christ. Okay, I've got a uh, logistics question here, so... I've gone to... Like, how am I gonna get this belt to go the other way? Because, like, I've got a gearbox twice to turn into here. Okay, um... The one, the shaft that's right to left of it, just replace it with a gearbox. Yeah, uh, that, right that shaft, yeah, just replace that with another gearbox. 
That's honestly yeah. the easiest way to do is just add another fucking gearbox. <laughs> yeah, just alternate the fucking gearboxes. There we go. The only time that a gearbox is a problem is if there's another shaft turning the wrong way next to it. Uh, but the way to fix that is with a gear shift. Yeah, or a chain drive. You could also do some shit with chain drives. Well, that's like if you're just trying to extend it even further. But I'm saying, like, if you're trying to change the direction. Hey guys, yeah, instead of running a big long thing, I'm gonna, I'm, uh, I'm gonna have you for that other belt. I'm gonna have you do something different. Okay. Um, I'm gonna chuck something into the system for you. Um, actually, I need to make two more. Give me one second here. Uh, chain. See, I just gotta get over to the other side now to power this belt here. There's in there, and then also... Also, have y'all seen the retarded windmill yet? <laughs> oh my god, that's beautiful. I love it. Hold on, keep that up. I'm gonna put it on stream real quick. What is that? <laughs> it's the retarded windmill. Fuck, oh, guys. It's beautiful. Um, I, just, I just took a stack of sails and stacked them anyway that worked. Do you have a gearbox on you, or do I need to make you one? I got a gearbox. Okay, uh, what you're gonna do... Okay, go into the system. Uh, mm -hmm. look up, uh, chain. Just chain and, uh, those in case chain drives. Okay, now there on the corner, uh, to get right. that belt, to get that belt moving, place one there, and then go around the other side, so you place, uh, actually, uh, uh, actually break, break, break those two. Uh, look at the one that's moving. Okay. So, like, the, uh, the side okay. of the, the outside one that's moving. Outside of the outside yeah, one. Yeah, right? like that one there, and you're gonna try and place it. You're gonna say so you kind of have to, and now you're gonna place the other two on the side of that one. So yeah, like that, rotate that one, and then last but not least, that one there, and then place the gearbox. Is that oh spinning the right way? I can't tell. Yeah, it's like yeah. right. Yeah. Okay. The frame, oh just for works. frame rate, just making. Yeah, <laughs> that's the easiest way to make shit turn corners. Is just three chain drives in a gearbox. I do it all the time over here in the factory. So. Well, that should be working then. Uh, oh wait, hang on, I gotta mob proof those blocks. I don't know if mobs can spawn there. Holy fucking shit. Holy shit! <laughs> How are you alive? How, is, how did he live? There was a couple that lived. I didn't like that. Also, why are these not collecting? Um, uh, hang on a minute. Let's, uh, right let's click on. on the shoot real quick with an empty hand. Okay. Oh, That's oh, there's a zombie heart in there. Okay. Yeah. Cause I murdered them. Yes. Yeah, cause you killed them. So drop the zombie heart. Okay, let's see. So that should all be set up. Now I just need brass tunnel. Yeah, I don't like the fact that a couple lives. That was weird. Yeah, I don't understand why that happened. Um, I don't think they but... could spawn on that on the fun the funnel. So... Yeah, probably not. Into the AFK spots. <laughs> all right. Uh, all right. I'm gonna leave now. Uh, I'm gonna AFK at the gold farm. Actually, how much stuff is in there? Actually, it's empty for the most part. So. <laughs> okay. Um. Before I'm gonna get off here in a couple of minutes. Before I get off, I will pop over there quick and make sure they're not like landing and living. So. All right. Um. And if you can figure out how to fix that, be my guest. I don't know how. <laughs> actually, I'm, I'm actually going to get off, like, right now, so I'm just going to fly over and check quick before I go to bed. And yeah, you can see them all just fall into their doom. I, I kind of want to see this. I'm going to walk. Which way do I have to go again? Southwest, you said? Yep, southwest, yeah. Enderman can be on the roof, apparently. Didn't fucking know that. I think that's because they could teleport on top of it. <laughs> I don't think they're Why actually spawning it... up here. 
this thing is placing sideways for some reason. Like it's showing it normal, but the text is sideways, fuck? and then oh, uh, sir, goes actually working. Okay. What the fuck? Yes. Um, sir. It's murder him. Working right. <laughs> He's a cheating bastard for existing there. Why did you go so far away? Because it has to be in another waste. In fact, I think you probably passed it. I think you gotta go north. A north? Uh, yeah, you're like 200 blocks south of it. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I make a fucking... Yeah, some are living. Not sure why or how that's even possible. Not sure. Damn it. I'm not sure. sure what they're why they're li living. You didn't this isn't built up any farther than the hoppers are, right? Yeah, no, I, I deliberately moved it down so that it wouldn't be above it, yeah. Mm, I got another idea here. Hmm. I don't so know. Go ahead and break that. You said you deliberately, like, moved it down, right? Yeah, I, I moved everything down a block, so. Okay, the only thing that I could think to do is maybe the belts cause some fucky shit, so we could cover the top of the belts with, uh,. We can cover the top of the belts with fucking shoots. So they die when they hit the shoots and the shoots just drop all the shit on the belts. It might have to be moved down another block then. Because the belts are where the hoppers were initially, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Although actually, it's probably fine because I haven't built the bottommost layer of the farm yet. <laughs> uh, yeah, you built you didn't build the bottom layer yet. Yeah, I'm building it top down. Okay. We can just not build that layer then. I mean, yeah. Well, yeah, if you want to try this, just putting more shoots onto it, sure. Yeah, let me. I'm gonna have to craft a fuck ton of them quick, but. Shoot. What the fuck. Why is it not working the way I want it to? Oh, fuck. We're out of iron plates. <laughs> Yeah, and they might mostly be fucking near, yeah, that side of the farm, so that might work. Try it. I'm gonna fly away for a minute. Right, they should yeah, be spawning you now. You might also just want to fly into the air a little bit, that might help as well. I mean, I'm so far away, it should work. Well, because you, you're still spawning stuff like under the bedrock. That's oh, what yeah, I, mean. I got an idea. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna come up with you. Yeah, that's probably the best thing to do. Oh yeah, I'm seeing them spawn now. Look at all those little bastards down there. <laughs> I'll wait a minute or two and then let them go. If I could try the shoots or I mean, or we could. Yeah. I can. I can. The hoppers put on the belt. I think they can, right? Yes, probably. I believe so. So, because we could, we could just try covering the fucking belts with the hoppers. Because yeah, the, the issue is, with though, the actually. The issue with the hoppers is just them passing into each other could keep up, but if yeah. each of them are depositing onto the belt, I think that'll solve it. That actually, yeah, might work, yeah. Right, I'm gonna go down and check it again. Okay, yeah, no, the, uh... Yeah, actually, actually the... Yeah, the ones that are living, they are landing and living with, like, full health. What if they actually can spawn on the... on the shoots? Oh, no. I mean, it feels unlikely, but I feel like that's the most logical thing. 
It's not a full block, though. That's the confusing part. Yeah. Well, I know for a fact they can't spawn on hoppers, so I guess just put hoppers on top of it and see if that works. Because, yeah, I still have all the hoppers that are just in the storage right now. Yeah. See, so, yeah, I know for a fact they weren't surviving when they were landing on the hoppers, and they definitely weren't spawning on it either. Yeah. Um. So, because you just had the hoppers feeding into the back of the thing, right? Yeah. Into the drawer well, controller. Well, here's the thing. I moved the drawer controller down a block. Okay. Um. So I'm thinking is we move the all these down a block, and then we just do the hoppers. Um. And uh, we just do the hoppers, and instead we have. All of the the hoppers all go down onto the belts, um, and, and but then instead of using a chute to deposit it, we just use one of the funnels with the belt running straight into the back. You know what I mean? Um, I'm not so sure actually. I'm too tired, brain hurts. Um, Maybe fair. I mean, yeah, I was I'm just thinking, just do this. to try that and no, you took all the hoppers out okay yeah this belt platform is a little bigger than it was originally so have to make some more hoppers yeah need six back here we do got iron in here right yeah yeah maybe put a uh, hopper over the chute as well Just in case they are spawning on the chute. Give that a try. Uh, yeah, that should work, hopefully. Right. Oh, we let them spawn. I'm gonna make a waypoint for this place. That way I don't get fucking lost. <laughs> So I went like 200 blocks south of here. <laughs> yeah. You do have the portal marked, right? Yeah, I have the portal marked. Alright. It'd be fucking stupid not to. That's how I get lost in the nether. Oh yeah, that's how you get lost and never find your way back out again. Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah, I can just see all the fucking dots on the minimap. Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I'm uh, pretty sure uh, one of... Yeah, I'm pretty sure one of two things uh, makes this mob farm really good. Either neutral mobs ignore the mob cap, or different dimensions have their own mob caps, and I, I'm leaning more towards the latter. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go down and check to see if there's any that are living. Nope, they're all dying now. Alright, so yeah, they were either spawning on, a, like, the chutes or something, or the, or the conveyors the belts were being weird, yeah. Yeah, the conveyors are just acting fucky. All right, and it's not getting clogged, right? The system. Uh, uh it didn't seem to be. Yeah, I, I assume not, cause yeah, it shouldn't probably shouldn't be getting clogged. Yes. I'll come back up with you. I'm gonna uh. And what we'll do is we'll sit AFK for like five minutes. I'm gonna run and go to the bathroom and stuff. Is give it a chance for stuff to actually like spawn and, and and give it a chance to clog it up. Have a bunch of items, and then after a couple minutes, I'll run down and check it and see. All right. Well, yeah, I'll do some cleaning up my room in the meantime then. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna run to the bathroom, grab a drink. So I'll be back in a couple minutes.
now have brick system. Because of where I had to put it, it was a pain in the ass to set up. Look at how low I had to put this chest. Are you are you here, Steven? No. Okay, he left. <laughs> Alrighty so then. Yeah. So, farm's probably been going long enough that if it is getting clogged, then it probably would have by now. So, uh. I got my brick thing set up, Kaiser. Mm -hmm. But because of where I had to put it, it was a fucking pain in the ass. It's not hard to make something that just smelts, uh, clay, you know? Mm. But look, just look at how far I had to dig down to get this chest in. It didn't, I saw you just went down, it didn't seem too clogged to me. It seems like it was keeping up pretty well. Yeah, it's just doing good. So. Holy fuck, yeah, five minutes up to nine blocks of gold. Yep, Steve, like, so. Steven, look at this bullshit. What? I had to dig so far down to get this set up because of where I put it. <laughs> or where I had to put it, I should say. Yeah. It's like very cramped in over here. But that's where all my clay's coming. Mm -hmm. It's fine though. I've now got infinite bricks. Alright, well. The gold farm's been improved, so... I'm gonna yeah. AFK for the night. <laughs> Alright, have a good night. Have a good night, I get to get started on my project of rebuilding everything. Uh -uh. Alright, so I'm gonna build it with uh, steel tiles for the floor. Yeah. Expensive as hell, but fuck it. <laughs> Gets the job done. Yes, sir. Probably gonna start back here with this stuff. This is my half automated invar bullshit. Because to make invar, you gotta make this nickel compound, which then smelts down into this unprocessed invar ingot, which you gotta beat with one of these presses 16 fucking times. And then once it's beat 16 times, it just magically turns into invar. <laughs> So I think I'm going to start with the lowest level being the stuff that I actually want. So, like, I'll have the actual and the site, like, the machine mechanisms at the bottom level. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a pain in the ass, but you know. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Plus, I'll be able to clean all this up and make it actually look nice. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. So let's see. I think I'll start the first floor, just like basic, and I'll expand it based on the top level. There you go. That's the spirit. I think first building will be the andesite stuff. And then I'll pipe over any items I need for the uh, next one to the next building. Yeah. Uh, either rebuild my uh, tree farm or just build a new one. Mm -hmm. That's just specifically for this. Have it basically trash anything that isn't uh, the, yeah. the wood. Okay, let's see. I need my shovel. Handy dandy toolbox. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just gave up on the toolbox. I, I'd rather use shulker box to save a lot more space. A lot easier. Well, the thing is that's real easy, so like, if I need to put something back, just click that, and then you just punch it once, it's, in, it's back in your inventory. Yeah, no, it's just... Plus, like I was saying, look at that. There's, It literally stacks more than what it shows. <laughs> yeah. Uh, eh, I like I like my shulker box. I think I'll start Also, uh, you yeah, don't, I don't think you, have, you don't have shulker boxes yet, so... Two, I could. <laughs> Yeah, three, four. Honestly, five. I could just get, I could just give you some because I think we have like twenty. Yeah, plus there's missions that you can complete that just gives you the stuff for them. Yeah, yeah, we have seventeen shulker boxes in the system. No, I believe it's market. Yeah, right there. Yeah, right fifty-five there. silver for one. Yeah. Two, three, four. Plus there's also the thing for uh. Call it. There's a import for it. Yeah. I mean, I could go to the end, but <laughs> <laughs> I have yet to go there. I don't plan to. I got kidnapped by a belt again. <laughs> See what you do. I think I'm gonna have to set up mechanical crafters with fucking sticks. Um. Oh. Because, like, because I need to get sticks to automatically to automate the crushing wheels. Mm, and there is that part that you need the crushing wheels for. Yeah, because you have to crush the crushing wheels to create an anomaly and create a black hole that fucks the entire universe, I guess. I don't fucking know. <laughs> um. There we go, I'm at 25 stacks of dirt. I've been gathering because I know I'm eventually going to need it. <laughs> so you have to make a flash drive. For, uh, like the last late game thing for the calculation mechanisms. Mm -hmm. Um, but the, uh, you can get an enchanted one that's unbreakable, and, um, it's fucking. The thing for it is called Windows Update. Oh, jeez. Let's see. Where's my wand? There it is. God damn, that's a whole fucking stack. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> Probably need like, another two stacks. There we go. Jesus. That took so much for one floor. <laughs> <sighs> Is there any other way to make steel than the blasting furnaces? Where the fuck is it? 
Perception is a white die. Let's see his lapis, because we have so much fucking lapis. Oh, yes, you can uh, blast the fucking iron. Sweet. Can what? You can blast iron. Yeah. Okay, so what I'm gonna do... Uh, this is a tough one. Because I don't want to stop producing iron over here. Yeah. way to turn off having it make the blocks of iron? I don't know. Because that's my biggest question right now. Because I think I know what I want to do. I'll have it drop the nuggets onto a conveyor, split it with brass, and then mm. have two compacting drawers. Mm, yeah. Problem is, I just don't know... Like, I, I don't want to accidentally making the wrong thing. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Fuck, I left my toolbox over here. Nice job, dumbass. <laughs> gonna be two here have them come forward uh, four thousand fight a girl that should be good have this one immediately go upwards to get in holy fucking shit yeah crystal growth accelerator is expensive as fuck <laughs> Looks any glass cables, which those are fucking expensive. Holy fuck! Okay, that'll be the one for the compactor. Just nice and simple. I need another compacting thing. Shit. I'm gonna build it before I get off for the night. I'm gonna build one more farm that I'm gonna need. It's a fucking beetroot farm. Cause I need to, I need die automated. Um. So. Harvester. Oh, those are fucking easy as fuck to make. Holy shit. They're cheap as shit.
Really? Ran out of kinetic, kinetic mechanisms of all things in the system. Could grab a couple <laughs> stacks of them. This they are like 100% automated now. I don't have to worry about the fucking planks, so. One, two, three, four. Wait, no, I should probably bring this forward one more now I'm thinking about because I need the smart shoot. And then. This guy, that's where another conveyor is going to be. It'll come forward to some point over here. I'll say there should be fine. Alright, and of all the things that I expected to watch in a pondering video, I did not expect to see a uh, fucking parrot get yeeted. But, alright. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, I need a fan and I need a lever. Lever, whatever. Lever, lever. Lever, I didn't even know her. Who were you? What did you do, with Uncle Slim? Um, who's Uncle Slim? <laughs> you ever watch Home on the Range? Uh, maybe. I'm gonna take this a fucking no. <laughs> Probably not. because I need to make another thing of interfaces. Give me those. Uh, chest. All the chests are fucking gone because apparently Kaiser used them all to make hoppers. <laughs> Be my fucking guess. Most likely. Uh, I'm assuming we have a hoe in our fucking... Yeah. Why do we have two Fortune 3 diamond, or a gold hose? What the fuck? Why not? I mean, I guess. <laughs> okay, this will come forward to about there. We'll have a smart shoot right. And yeah, we'll send it one further. We'll have a smart shoot Ready? there. It'll drop down into a drawer. Okay, so now... Uh, dirt.
it up like that. Come over here. Need one of these. There we go. It's going the right way. smart shoots before I worry about anything else. Let's see, how many do I need? I need... Two. I need two smart shoots and two... And I need what another compacting fuck? floor. What? That's not what I wanted to happen. What'd you do? Uh, made a fucky wucky with a damn, uh, building one. <laughs> See what you do. <laughs> and just a slight fucky wucky. Alright, let's see. No, come back here, dirt. Um, You're not getting away. I need a normal drawer. Zinc, stone, I need five stone, I need pistons. Ah. Uh. So much work. Yeah. Yeah. One time, hop my ass over four, to five, this six, side of this six. of the factory because I need the um. I need some of the electrodes. Electron tubes. Yep. Oh, thank you for the follow, perfect frost mage. Let's see. You're here for my uh, late night manic factory building. <laughs> uh, probably sleep so it's daytime. Otherwise known as late night, I have no clue what the fuck I'm doing. Yes. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> um. Ba -da 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 -ma -ma. Fucking. Why is there a phantom on me? I slept like two days ago. Fuck off. Let's see, I need these. Come here, bitch. You, you dying today. So I need nope. four cobble, two bitch. redstone. I saw that. I saw you drop that phantom membrane. Where the fuck it go? There it is. I was gonna say, saw me drop something. I haven't dropped anything. The fuck? <laughs> no. I'm... Bitch, I'm missing fucking... for another. Bitch, at the fucking phantom being a cunt. Oh, I didn't grab enough cobble. God damn it. Heh, <laughs> get fucked. Ah, my inventory's full. Get fucked. <laughs> Yeet. Me totally not just chucking stuff out on the ground. That's definitely what yeet means. I you do fucking way lie too to often. <laughs> Alright, I need the drawer, which I've got the stuff to make. I've got the stone smelting. Perfect, perfect. Got that. Da -da -da. Come over here and make a drawer. Let's see, here he goes. Yeet! And then he acts like he's fucking innocent. <laughs> Alright, got those. Come over here. Make one of these. Bada bing, bada boom. Uh, da -da -da. I need to make the smart shoots. So I'm gonna have to place this down, get two shoots. And then I need, I need, I need, I need. Two brass. And flatten their asses. Uh -oh. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, that's this, this, and what a bang, bada bam. Do 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 do
There we go. Place down this bastard. There we go. It'll automatically start compacting what it needs. Uh, blah, blah. Break this boy. Because that's going to be where that one goes. And come down here. I need my storage drawer. I need to book it. Make it so I can actually access the bastard. Go like that. I need my steel. And now I need to take my glass and just in case the end of this. Gentlemen, I have obtained the bucket. Now before I get that yeeting over. Let's see. Place you down. I need this and this. Let's hope it's spinning the right direction. And it is not. <laughs> Why would it right. be so easy? Okay. I think I can just cheat this and do this, though. The fun of having a gearbox nearby. Perfect. Now, I need my bucket. Go grab a bucket of lava. I'm so glad I'm rebuilding all this because this is such a mess to get through. <laughs> <laughs> As I just casually have to jump over like hundreds of conveyor belts and whatever else is in the way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> place that down, place a glass block so nothing falls into the lava. Perfect, perfect. Um ba -da -dum -ba. I think I just need this last piece moved. Ooh. How do I not have any of that shit in my Where in here? Did that go? What? Perfect. You fuck it. Okay, come here. All right, I need this here. Come back here. And now I need to set down one last brass funnel. Okay, perfect. It is loading both of them. Look at that. Obviously, it's not going to be super fast, but now I'll have actual steel production. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. Hmm. Not having to smelt is going to be fucking phenomenal. <laughs> Let's see. Give that a moment so I can actually see it. that works. I gotta wait for enough nuggets to come through. <laughs> no, yeah. Yeah. Actually, I see nuggets are coming through. I think I picked some up. So we can make that a little faster. Oh, wrong way. There we go. Look at that. Went in and... Smelting. Might take a yeah. while. Hell yeah. yeah. While. Look at that. Oh, fucking steel me. production. Pardon me why I make fucky wuckies. <laughs> Guess who's gonna have all the fucking repair kits? <laughs> Me. No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Dude, this is so pleasing because making that steel is a pain in the fucking ass. Yes. Being as it took the special thing, the fucking glass and furnace, I didn't think it was gonna have just an easy way to do it. Quick. Now, the question is how much do I actually want to do tonight because it is already late. Yeah, like I said, I'm finishing this farm and then I'll be uh, getting on. Yeah. But I think I'm going to have to make more calm coast, unfortunately. All right, let's see. Hell yeah, there's already two steel ignits. Nice. <laughs> Obviously, it'll take a while, but you know. Yeah. 
Yeah, that would make more compass fuck. Imagine if it didn't let me just pick up this compacting drawer and I ended up with like it's almost three stacks of iron in my inventory. <laughs> hmm. That's actually Oh fuck, I didn't want to take that much, you bastard. You bet they took that you. much. Okay, so I'm gonna break some of these down. Just so I can get this running a little bit. There we go, two full s or one full stack of Oh yeah, no, a decent bit of iron. I forgot I picked up fucking <laughs> two blocks of the iron. I think I think you can blast the blocks of iron into blocks of steel. Uh let me double check. If so, I can make this easier. Uh, gotta go to the steel, fuck. Or I guess only iron. No, you you could go to steel. Either way works, yeah. Yeah, you could just... If I can fucking spell. Yeah. God damn, Julian, are you alright? I have a cigarette in my hand. <laughs> no. Aww, that's bullshit. It's bullshit of the highest order. Let's uh, find our way to iron. Go the ops. Or actually, yeah. Let's do that. Do that. Now, let's see. For crafting with it. You know, it shows nothing for blasting. Yeah, it's sad. That'd be cool, though. Hell yeah, look at that. There's a fucking stack of steel already. That nice. is so nice. Gonna dump a shit ton in. Which obviously is gonna slow down the uh, smelting, but oh well. Look at that, all that iron in there. <laughs> hmm. Hey, it's faster than using the blasting furnace. Fuck it, yeah. hell. Now I hate that I even set up this system over here, because that was so much easier. Oh my god, let me through. Like, I have this fucking wall of blasting furnaces here. Yeah. And there's just no point for them, though. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> the funny thing is that the only reason I got to this point of automating it is I'm because I'm just, my floors. <laughs> I was just about to say, I was just about to say, can you not sleep? Ah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> Next night. <laughs> Just remind me before the sun goes down. Yeah. Okay, I think I left my uh, toolbox over there, so I gotta go back over there. Mm -hmm. Okay. So now I gotta work this all backwards. <laughs> so the very first floor, I'm gonna want the mechanisms. That is correct. Which I have over here. <clears throat> Ouch. <laughs> okay, so mechanisms. Let's see, so I'll start with the sequencing. That'll be the very front of the building. Mm. Which needs three deployers. Ah, oh, this is gonna be so much fun. <laughs> My fucking mess I have to jump over. <laughs> 
go get some food before I forget to. I'm gonna have to put more rice in there soon. Okay, let's see. I need the gold, which I think I should have enough already in here. Yeah. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, I need twelve, I believe. <clears throat> this is gonna be lots of fun. <laughs> <laughs> That's the bitch. That's I'm not even gonna build the actual walls until I have the building done. Yeah. Cause like I said, I'm gonna expand the uh, floor based on the upper levels. Mm-hmm. Still have three. Hell yeah. It's one less step for now. Centers right here. I'm gonna put just one tile down here so I know where the very front is. Mm -hmm. That's where we come in. I'm gonna need to set that guy down. I'm gonna need this guy and this guy to start. Do -do. We'll say right about here. One, two, one, two. Mm -hmm. Hmm. This is gonna be such a pain in the ass to set up, but it'll be nice when it's done. Yeah. And if Logan does not appreciate my aesthetic. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that lag spike. Yeah. Okay, let's see. I think I want it to run to the right. And from there... I'm gonna need it to split. Probably just bring them both upwards, like so. And then... Now consider some little small block. I might expand the floor too, even before I get to an upper level to have more on one floor, but we'll see. Yeah. Cross that bridge when you get to it. Yeah. Because I think I want to have the andesite alloys on the same floor, but I don't know how much space that's going to take up. Mm. Okay, so now this. I need shoots. One will drop into a drawer. 
which I guess I should go make that real quick. Make a uh, crafting table over there so I just have one. Actually, I think yeah. there's one nearby. I think my plan is for tonight, I want to get the first floor done. Sure. What time is it actually? True, Jesus, maybe not. Yeah, I'm. Um, <laughs> I was gonna, I wanted to wait for all these to decompose in the restore. That's why I didn't want you to sleep because it does it bit faster, lower light levels. Yeah, oh, jeez. So, but I think it's just gonna wait for tomorrow. I gotta go to bed. I got work. That's, I'll finish my current contraption. And then I'll worry about that. Yeah. Uh, I need one. Hi, do you have a good night? You as well. Okay, this one, because I plan on using an item pipe. Oh, why the fuck am I doing that? Let's see. Take that, take that. There we go. Because I want to have an item pipe come uh, from this building to the next. I'm just going to use a chest. Do it like so. And that will be what goes into the next place. Uh, da -da -da -dum. Okay, so that will all be going the same way, of course. Maybe I should have a hand crank, because that might make it easier to see what is happening with this. <laughs> Okay, but for now, that's that. Um, one side will have, I think it's the saw. How do I make the infinite saw? Five gold. Oh, shit. Okay, let's see how much silver I have, because I want to get one made that's going to last. So now I have some of the chests here first. Okay, we got gold, we got some silver. Let's go ahead and do manual trade. Thank you, that's two. I need three more to get my permanent saw. Real question right now is if there's anything actually gotten over here. Ugh, not much. Fuck it, we'll do that. Is that all the rice that's made, though? God damn. This farm does not make as much rice as I thought it did. Weepster. <laughs> hey. <laughs> you sounded very disappointed. What? You sounded very disappointed. Oh no, I just didn't know that there was someone there. Uh, when I'm streaming, I have streamer mode on. I just heard you breathe, and I was like, wait, what? I thought Steven just <gasps> left. <laughs> uh, uh, obviously, I am on stream. Just a mm -hmm. uh, casual warning. <laughs> I need to get... The, um, what? How did the, um... Ark go? The Ark is lovely. So far, everyone's enjoyed it. May has not yet seen it. And she's the one who's gonna see it most. Um... Right now, I'm currently working on essentially rebuilding my entire system. Yeah. Because now that I have the supplies to, I want to get it actually, like, made in a more efficient and more, uh... Maneuverable way. <laughs> but, uh, first thing I did was decide on what I wanted to use. I now have automated steel because I want to make steel flooring. 
but steel flooring is fucking expensive. Yeah. <laughs> That's, uh, it's like 16 steel tiles takes, uh, four steel, but the steel itself you have to smelt from iron, and it takes so much to do that, so I set up automation. <laughs> I have kind of forced through a little bit of speed to get started, but uh, thanks to that, I now already have nine stacks of steel. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, let's see. What was I doing? What was I doing? I guess before anything, I should probably actually connect the deployers to the system. It's probably a good idea. See, we're gonna need this guy. Put him up like that. I was just looking, uh, I wanna get automated, like, I, I need to get a uh, permanent uh, saw so that I don't have to ever replace it. Mm -hmm. Costs five fucking gold. Which I thought wouldn't be a problem. But my rice farm does not produce as much silver as I would like it to. So here I am, just waiting, hoping. <laughs> Wait, you mean like gold bars, right? Gold coin. Actually, I wonder if I can make gold coin. No, I cannot. Oh my god. No, you, it says you can, but you need like some very You, you have to stuff. trade for it. Ah, uh, this uh, is a trade uh. station. Um... um the best way to do that is through using silver. You can trade it for the gold. Mm. Apparently, another I mean, coin is not a thing. <laughs> you get two golden coins if you kill the entry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Problem is, is that there's only ever one egg, so... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you, you do that, and you're never getting it back. God, could you imagine if like someone's running a large server of this? Someone goes, fights the Ender Dragon before anyone else, and just sells the egg. <laughs> <laughs> of course, you can reset the end, but... You know. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I'm trying to think here. Actually, can I sell steel? I'm sure that's worth a bit. Let's see, click that. No. You sell cookies. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hold on, I'm my door. Um, how about just straight up iron? I'm sure that's probably a thing. No? Fuck. Alright. Time to just look through what the trade station actually works with. <laughs> see we can automate. Let's see. I'm looking for like stuff that I can just easily make. Mm, does it just take any of the tools? But that makes just one silver coin, so that's not even worth it. Enter... Limestone. The rice is what I'm selling, but it's one bag of rice for a fucking single coin. <laughs> Pumpkins. But again, that's a whole bunch for a little bit. I'm trying to look for something that I can craft. Oh, hello, Llama. <laughs> uh, here's a trader next to you. Yeah, so it would. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, hold on, go back, go back, back. Phantom membranes. What? Go back. Phantom ah. membranes. Yeah, it's worth a decent bit, but getting them is a pain. Plus, I'm not really decked out for fighting. <laughs> 
da, da. Gold, golden there helmet. That might Maybe. be uh, that might be my method actually. Let's keep that in mind because it produces five, and I've definitely got gold. You serious? You can sell a breath of the dragon for one silver coin. <laughs> you serious? Beautiful. Jesus, I'm on page 38 of 167. Seared bricks is a pain in the ass, so I'm not selling that. Cinnamon toast. <laughs> the fuck is that? Guardian spike? Gold boots. But they yeah, sell like... for less than the other. Although I guess it's the same amount of gold. Mmm... fuck is that? Catalyzing gland? The fuck? Interesting. <laughs> Sexy for seaweed for one silver coin. See, I could do that, because I've got seaweed, but that it's just so fucking much, and my seaweed farm is not that fast. <laughs> if the stuff grew quicker, you know. Hmm. Let's see, the sword was worth two... I'm pretty sure then that means the golden chest will probably still look then. <gasps> Appetite! I've got- s I've probably got a shit ton of that. Not that, like, I'll probably run out of it quick is the problem, but, you know. I've got some rubies, so that can get me jump started on some stuff. I th think I use niter for a few things, so I don't want to go getting rid of that. Look up a golden chest. How much of that sells for? Uh, well, I'm gonna get there eventually, because I'm also looking through as I'm going. So iron stuff is worth about as much as the gold. From what I can tell, it looks like the uh, gold and iron is worth about as much as the uh... gold. Hold gold. up. Hmm. Smithing. Might be better. That's actually currently my option, because I've got infinite apples. <laughs> Alright, let's see. So, golden apple, that's currently the top on the list. Diamonds, which I don't really use. <laughs> I think they're good for some things, though, still. Uh, steel is essentially on the level of diamond, so I just use the steel because it's easier to get. Yeah, tears. Hmm. <laughs> How much was it worth? Ten. Golden apples do seem better since you don't need that. I will s no, because that also uses, like, wood to make. I was going to say that's a little more for the gold, but... It takes too much to actually make that. Mm. So, you, so you can sell a diamond for ten, but you can buy a diamond with a gold. Yes, oh that's how God. the market works. <laughs> That's, I'm definitely looking at that one thing so far still, the golden apple. Because that's just, compared to everything else, that is so cheap. Because it's what, just an apple and golden nuggets, right? I... Probably. What? The iron chest play is only worth four silver coins? The fuck? <laughs> oh, I guess iron... Iron boots is actually... Wait, I thought we saw iron earlier and it was about the same as much as gold. What the fuck? Why is it not now? No, no, I think that was the leggings. 
Maybe. Sulfur, that's... I don't find enough of that. And I use it for my gunpowder. Yeah, I was right. Gold chest weighs eight. Yeah. One per each, uh, ignit. Then it would technically be better than to... Yeah, it would be better to go to Knuckles then. Yeah, so far. Yeah, you're right. You've reached the end. Yep. I think the Golden Apple's the best. Do, do, do. But does it require ingots or nuggets? I don't remember. Either way, it still will be cheaper. Just because I've got infinite. Uh, let's see. Golden, Golden Apple. Ooh, it is ingots. <laughs> That's fine. Still my best option. Uh, so before I even do anything else, I need to come in here to the bulletin board. It is the smithing. Oh, I guess that's this one. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, actually, I also need to come in here. Shipments. Not that one. This one. Yeah, I'm gonna have to trade one of my gold coins. <laughs> Dang. There we go. It's worth it to get it set up. Wrong one again. And bam. That's fits good, sir. <laughs> <laughs> uh, before I even do that, I need to look at the dynamos, because where I'm gonna set this up is in a spot where I can easily access my lava. Okay, copper machine and red flux coil, that's decent to make. It's the copper machine that's gonna be a little bit of a pain. Mm, one. Can't you automate making those things? Well, I've got the stuff for it, it's just I got to go around gathering it. Ouch. <laughs> uh, let's right. see if I got any first. Um, okay, uh, I, I gotta go now, dude. You gotta go? Mm hmm. Yeah, have a good night. Have a good night. Let's see. Do, do, do. Okay. So I need. I guess let's just put this dynamo away because I don't need that. We need eight of these things over this way. Oh god, gang over there's a pain now. There we go. I do not have a copper casing, so we're going to have to grab my copper. Fuck, I don't have any logs on me. Do I not have any logs at all? Ah, I'm going to have to go grab one. To make a void thing for that at some point. Uh, do I have... No, I only have three obsidian. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Oof, got so much shit in my inventory. Okay, do this. Do that. Fuck. Not what I needed. <laughs> Do this and do that. There we go. 
that, and... Oh, I didn't make the other thing. Which is two gold... Or no, one gold and two redstone. There we go. Now we're ready. That and that. There we go. Not how I wanted you to place. There we go. Uh, grab this guy. There. There we go. Looks like you can hold about four. Oh, nice. Okay. Uh, let's go gather some lava real quick. Give that a moment. I think I'm gonna have to place chunk loaders in here and uh, as soon as I can get the underminium shit, get my lava source coming through. Till then, we got this going on. Is that already full? I swear to God. I knew it's faster, but Jesus. Not risking that. noise passively or did it get like hurt on something because I've seen them like step on my lava stuff before and actually catch fire I do gotta say my nether portal is a lucky one most games when I start out it uh I end up stuck outside uh area where like ghasts and such spawn but this playthrough I managed to get one in the uh, warped forest so all of the uh, all the spawns in this area are just endermen Like, if I just keep it close, but not there, if it'll work fine. Yeah, that's almost fully charged. Okay, we'll go ahead, uh... Fuck, I left that thing over there, so we'll have to do this. We'll get a stack to start. Back of the apples and make them all golden. I don't think my spruce one produces apples.
Actually, I need to come back. I think it's over here. Yes, sir. Shit, I don't have much gold right now. Hmm. Oh, it's because this is a gay granite. Fuck. I think me switching to this system probably fucked it up. Cause like it's trying to keep sending from just one. Let's see. If I... Let's grab the granite. We'll add a couple of pipes to this, I think. But for now, I want to come in here. I need to grab the receiver thing. I think it's in here? No. Which one did I put it in? The fun game of finding out. Well, there's where those are. Where's the one I had made? There it is. And then we go over here and tell it granite. I see. Okay, so I'm gonna have to... I think I'm gonna set up a system underneath that takes the two and send those ones straight through. So let's see. Um, ba -dum -ba -dum. I know I'll have to do more tomorrow, but for now, just so we can get this gold going, let's go on down and specify. with that. Oh fuck, wrong thing. There we go. Does that not work the way I thought it did? Should allow the one that's going through. See, it's allowed that. What about disallowed? What happened? Maybe it's fucking hell. Let's take just the one. We'll go back in here and specify that it's granite allowed. Let's go back to the top and we're gonna remove the uh, receiver piece.
<clears throat> I mean, this is a good learning experience. <laughs> but that's about it right now. goes. I think that's all granite. Okay. And then I should be able to go down and tell it and the site as well. Go to the top, grab another pipe. I should be able to set up to essentially only grab the one type down here. I wonder if I can attach more brass pipes around to add, like, to how much it grabs. I don't know, though. So that should be specifically taken the two things that I told it it's allowed. Oh, okay, stuff is gone. Now it's gonna it's probably gonna be a while before this gets backed up, so we'll take this. Fuck. Okay. Take this. Let's go. Got some more brass pipes somewhere. Maybe. Oh, I got one left. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Let's drop that off. I don't need that. Come in here. Grab one, two, and three. Say you'll be right there. Fuck. I need that wrench. Once I get the wrench, I can set up this extraction module. And I can specify the uh, gabbro and the diorite. And then that'll be enough to keep it from causing too many issues tonight. Fuck. 
Okay, I need... I need a need... That pipe wrench. I knew it was in there. I don't know. Okay. Got that. Um over here. I was having a brain fart. Brain aneurysm, whatever. <laughs> need that one. Swap this for a Gabbro. And we can deposit that guy. Alright. So now that is being emptied from two sides. question. Am I able to speed it up by adding another pipe with a extraction module? Because if I can do that, then we can probably get this running even before we have all this stuff set up. Because that's honestly the hardest part here, is getting everything running. will make a bunch of extraction modules in the assumption that yes. Uh, speaking of those, see that's pretty pipe. To make that, it takes the brass pipe module. So we'll make another set of them actually, and just make a bunch. on, come over here, granite, and that, allow, yes, yeah, so it looks like that's functioning right, at that rate, we can then come down here, deposit that back in, deposit that in, Grab out some Gabbro. There we go. Now that's always going to be at infinite. Because that's essentially what it is is a throwaway box.
But now we have it essentially sped up. Actually. What if I instead pointed them all upwards? Essentially added a bunch of extraction modules to send it up instead of worrying about setting it down here. So let's go like this. Let's actually pick this guy up. Yeah, it looks like it's sending a lot more. Let's get up there before this makes a mess. <laughs> I think that's all the sides I can access right now anyway. But that ensures that we're definitely getting them. Um, what I can do then is actually I can go down and remove one from each so that each pipe only takes the one type. Guaranteeing that it's constantly grabbing each of them. Never stagnating on one. What the fuck? Where did I get cobble? Alright. So that's definitely running a lot better now. Let's go down and do that specification. This one here will make just Gabbro. This one here will make just Diorite. This one here will make just the Granite. And this one here will make just the Andesite. There we go. So now we'll be constantly sending all four. No problems whatsoever. Of course, there's a speed issue, but that's another story. That's something that will have to get fixed down the line. Until we get there, this is good enough. <laughs> yeah, see that? Now it's actually producing. Now if I come over here, of course there's no gold blocks yet, but the fact is, is that now there is actually stuff coming through, being ground up to turn into it. Let's wait a moment to see one. Are you coming through? Unless something got clogged up in there. No, it's going in. Is there something in here? No. Try disconnecting and reconnecting real quick because something's not going right here. Actually, I think I see. Fuck. I need another smart shoot. Damn it! 
<laughs> Can't believe I've never set one there. It's actually weird to me that I haven't. Okay, so we're gonna have to go ahead and actually, uh... God, these earpieces are bugging me right now. We're gonna need to actually smelt a granite so we have it. I could have sworn I had one there. Actually, let's run all the way for the uh, electrodes real quick, because I know I need some. We'll grab a full stack, bring them this way, just so I have them on hand instead of having to run back and forth. And then worry about from there. Got the electrodes. Oh, fine. What what do you have, mister? Well, you got the globe, but don't got the shit to buy that from you. Oh, well. Go ahead and grab this shoot. Hopefully I can get it without flying to Lord knows where. I did not get it. Ouch. Grind it. Fuck. Oh, looks like I gotta make a new one. I got too much shit in my inventory. I always do, though. Now it should function. We'll just wait for one to come up. Shouldn't be too long. Hello? Maybe? Bunch of the same stuff coming through. Where's the stuff I need? <laughs> Fuck. That's a 
it does look like I got it running faster than uh, what's producing because I actually got I actually got to a point where it's showing space now, you know? I don't know, it's still filling up. Yes, he's sending one, sending one. Yeah, see, it is sending. Granite. It's just slow. So, I'm thinking... I'm thinking we'll go ahead and get some more charcoal for that dynamo thing, because I'm sure it's probably empty. That's probably why this is slow. are bouncing back. Because oh. it only has so much speed it can deposit at. So I think if I build it up this way, go ahead and break it here. Did I get what I was looking for? Diamond pipe, thank you. Fucker. <laughs> See, now it's actually placing down along all of them. Yeah, and now it's actually smelting them. Nice. Which means I've actually got sand coming down here. Hell yeah. That's It must have gotten sped up at some point from me connecting everything. I've noticed a few different things get broken up by doing that. It's irritating when it happens, but hey, it happens, you know. stuff being produced. I 
thought I was going to have more of these to start with, but my gold production, of course, had to have been in a bad situation. Hell yeah, look at that. Now, in the meantime, I do got lots of iron. So let's go ahead, break them down. Oh, fuck. I didn't think about that. Already about made my money back from buying the goddamn thing for smithing. Okay, let's go in here. Market, trade. Thank you. Oh, what was I doing? Hey, let's go see how much gold I've got so far. That's even though I know it's not going to be fast, there should be at least, yeah. See, now we're actually working. <laughs> oh, we took half a fucking century. Sadly, there's nothing that uses the uh, steel to get money.
Okay. So as soon as we get this saw, I'm gonna call it a night. That is the goal. We're at four, we need one more. That'll be just about enough. I think I need one more to just make a nice, simple gold coin. Yep, one more. There we go. Bam. All right. Now we already have some saws made. I doubt that it's gone through all of them. So we're gonna go ahead and grab that guy. It's over here. is over here. Oh, wrong side. There we go. Now I got a permanent saw for my machine. Um, next thing that I'll be doing tomorrow is setting up to combine it with uh, like have andesite alloy get into it. And then we'll figure out how we're getting the andesite alloy made. Um, I'm thinking I might end up spreading the floor another bit. I'm thinking spread this way, at least one more space, and then spread back. We'll see. Most likely definitely spread back. But for now, we'll get ourselves back to home. Oh, wait. That's right, my toll box is out here. We're not going to leave the toll box out. That's a good way to forget where the hell I put it. There we go. Actually, let's check the gold before getting back. This is still the easiest way. There we go. Alright, see, we already have two again. <laughs> so that'll be a thing for tomorrow to worry about. Alright. And from there we'll call a night. Uh, if anyone is still out there, I know we've got some lurkers, but it doesn't uh, show whenever 
Essentially, Twitch doesn't acknowledge it unless you have the volume on a little bit. And I think it has to be the open window. Uh, but so, my viewer count shows as one. I'm going to go ahead and just end stream without a raid because of that. It is very dickish to raid someone with out having the, the, the... When it's one, it's a bot, essentially. <laughs> Alright, have yourselves a fabulous night, and we'll see you probably tomorrow.